What'll it be? So tailsy, what'll it be? What'll it be? What'll it be? So tailsy, what'll it be? Uh, let's see. Your very own time machine. What'll it be? Anything for you, my son. You can have all of movies. What'll it be? It's a three for none. What do you want? What if I gave you four billion pounds of ham? A little thing here. Change my mind. What would it be? <laughs> what would it be? You're telling me. So what would it be? <laughs> what, 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 what would it be? I'm waiting. What would it be? <laughs> what would it be? Worldwide TV. So what would it be? <laughs> what, 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 what would it be? I'm waiting. <laughs> what would it be? So tailsy. What would it be? What would it be? Tailsy, what will it be? Uh, let's see. This wonderful size calculator. Tell me your choice. It's a simple task. You can have total domination of Mobius. All you have to do is ask. What do you want? A chili dog? Perhaps 4,002. How about this? This unsightly, shapeless tub of goo. Just name your prize. Anything. And your price is no one. So three for none. What do you want? What if I gave you four billion pounds of ham? A little thing here, a little there. I got it. What about that dam? Name your prize, the finest cake. And your price is no object. Robotnik Lake. And what's this? What did you find? Tell me now before I change my mind. What would it be? This 
unsightly, shapeless tub of goo. Just name your prize, anything, and your price is no object, not bad play. What's this? Let's see what you got. Show me now before I blow my top. So what would it be? <laughs> what would it be? Even my laboratory. So what would it be? <laughs> this episode of Translator's Notes is brought to you by Nadir Many, MPD. When criminals are on the run, so is Nadir Many. A Sun TV production. What a bang you are. I stretched this one real far. <laughs> I was like, I gotta have something to go on. I was like, well, given how disastrous Amabe's last episode was. Nay, oh, dear man. many. <laughs> I love just the absolute panic of like, no, you don't understand. I'm literally going to die. Okay. <laughs> Gamer is having none of it. Oh. Um, also, for the intro song, that is something Kevin sent me, and it has been in our heads for like the last two weeks, I think. Oh, yeah, no, exactly. That one, like, the skydiving one is the big one for me. <laughs> just win the race is my fave. Oh, yeah. Win the race. Just, just win, win the, the race. race. I don't care what it takes. <laughs> That's fucking hard. Uh, I should put a link to that kid's band camp and make his day. Um, yeah. Let's see. You can find that track. And this kid, this kid uh no idea of gender but that is their business um you can find their music here and there's a lot of cool stuff yes and silly youtube but there's one called objection funk which i still haven't checked out oh uh, objection funk is really good it's uh it's made from sound and uh voice files from uh ace attorney nice anyway uh, that one's also a jam oh nice and There's a YouTube video for it that's pretty cute too. Ooh, I'll have to check that out. Speaking of less cute things, the opinions and views expressed herein are solely those of the hosts and are not representative of Sega, Spike Chunsoft, Hololive, or whomever's game we happen to be playing, unless it happens to be something we made ourselves. With that out of the way, let's get entertained. Burn down society, kids. It's your responsibility. Yep. <laughs> See, we said that after the waiver, so it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. And yeah, he did do Objection Funk. Yep. Hey. And it's on his website, so... Yep. Man, so, when we last left, poor, poor Uma. Oh my god. <laughs> Uma's story has gotten funnier. tragicomic to the max. Yeah. Yeah, it has gotten funnier, that's for sure. Like, he's... Doing the right thing is super hard, and then there he is, with poor Kama, just like, yeah! <laughs> like no, no thanks. I've I already gave it the office. <laughs> kind of feel. All right. <laughs> all right. So yeah, he's like he's like I need to return all of the stuff I stole, and it turns out that Sanji has apparently swapped out the jewels for just a bunch of ashtrays, and like Kame was like, I mean, go back and turn them in yourself. Like I don't have time to deal with petty larceny right now. I'm trying to stop the city from blowing up. <laughs> Which he's already done a few times. Yes. Choto Gage is on Mate. I love Kima's dead expression. Like I I don't know who like, you are. I am walking like, away. Hold now. Up. Like detective, wait up. <laughs> I don't so so no jama desu. Ichatte kudasai. It's like you're interfering with my investigation. Please go away. <laughs> Uh, uh, the young detective uh, hurried along without looking back at Umabe. Okay, that's just another zapping point, and we've got like three already, so we're good there. Uh, yeah. Yes, we have uh, came at 10.50 already yeah. tagged, so we're good. Eiji-san! Detective! Umabe-wa-ato-otte-hitotori-no-tsukunai-roji-ni-haita. Umabe followed after him uh, into a um, an alley that was not trafficked by many people. 
Wait a minute, detective. You're getting in the way of the investigation. Detective! Um Umabe followed him into a deserted alley. Oh, a deserted alley is a better way to say that. Thanks, Greg. Yeah. <gasps> uh, oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> like, suddenly Sanji appeared from behind the set, like, behind something. Oh my god, is this a bad end? Maybe. Triple Goki! Triple Goki! Umabe wa koshio nukashi so ninata. Like, Ushio thought, like, he might, like, double over, or, like, you know, he was taken aback. Yeah. Keiji wa Sanji ni kizukanu mama yitte shimatta. Uh, without noticing Sanji, the detective headed off. Uh oh. Suddenly, Mitsugi appeared from the shadows. Umabe lost his composure. I mean, losing composure, that's a... Yeah, for... that's a better way to say it, yeah. yeah he... I guess. The detective left without noticing Miyoshi. You know, everyone's favorite character, Miyoshi. Miyoshi, Mitsugi. Goddamn it, Greg. Sanji wa... Usuarai wo ukabe nagara umabe no mae ni tatta. Like, Sanji stood before Umabe with a faint grin on his face. Oh no. <laughs> Just Umabe like, I am so dead. Uh... <clears throat> Is that Ow? Ow. That's Ow. Ow. It's like, oh. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Ow Jiro no Umabe wa sono makaru kokenai. Like, Umabe had gone pale and couldn't move. <laughs> It's like, you weren't gonna go off, like, with, like, the jewels now that we find they hadn't secured just to save your own bacon, were you? Oh, you know what? Uh... This might be a bad end because I'm guessing there's something we do in Kama's part that changes this timeline. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Well, let's see. Because because we haven't activated it, it's going to assume yeah. Kama made whatever bad choice. Yeah. Abari ushi mo nishi ni ochita monda, and it's like how the mighty raging bull has fallen. Oh. Oh. No. Oh, poor Uma. Mitsugi stood in front of Abe Shinzo with a faint smile on his face. Oh, the pale Umabe couldn't move from where he was. Are you ready to save yourself by handing over the treasure you finally obtained? The rampaging cow has also fallen to the ground. And just like that, Greg shits the bed. Greg right, shits the bed. His fart is on the floor. <laughs> It's like, I thought you were acting strange, so I swapped out the contents of the bag. I mean, Sandy yeah. is a lot smarter than we gave him credit for. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, no! Doku no kato atta tsukimiria an no And it's just like... I, like, my plan was to, like, tail you to see where you might go. Oh, they're outside of Rungo oh. Rungo. Oh. That's the arcade, right? Because that's where he stopped at Kama's thing. Yeah. yeah. He's certainly somewhere in, like, the sh the, the, the Booyah streets. Booyah. Uh, I saw a video on YouTube, uh, it was like, 10 things to do in Shinjuku, and I'm like, is number one, go to Shibuya. Holy <laughs> Shinjuku, go to Shibuya. Yeah. Ten, ten, ten. Ten, ten, ten. All right, Greg. Disappoint us. I'm sorry to hear about your brother's behavior. We should change the contents of your bag. Like, wrong. If that what this is like. Okay, so to put into analogy, this is like the time my first car had an electrical failure, and a fuse popped, but it popped in a way where it fused itself to the circuit and kept running. Like, this sounds like it would be a Sanji line. If it were written that way. <laughs> it's like, I'm sorry to hear about your brother's behavior. We should change the contents of your bag. 
And they we had to know. send our uncle away. He was more than happy. <laughs> <laughs> Masaka Ushio Masami Tomo Arohito ga Mukashi no Naka ma Uragirito ane. It's like, who would have thought that, like, like, Ushio Masami of all people would betray one of his oldest friends? Ten, ten, ten. Uh, uh, Ushio Masami. Maybe he's doubting it. Yeah. Well, no, that's the first time he's actually getting the guy's name. He doesn't yeah. know the full name of the guy he's been mistaken oh, for. Oh, right. Uh oh. And it's like, like betrayal is payable. Is like is payable with death. Like that's you told me that a long time ago. Oh fuck. Uh, I can't believe that someone like Masami Ushio. How does he get it right yeah. this time? Yeah. Is it because he has the extra context that Masami is also a name kanji? Maybe. Maybe, I mean... I don't know. Uh, would betray our old relationship, dot dot dot. Masami Ushio. Atone for betrayal with death. That's what my brother used to say. My brother, yeah, Nanji. My brother. Yeah, Niji. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and then there's Ichiji. Ichiji. Yes. They're all based on ours. I remember I had did I ever mentioned this story I had a college roommate named Yasumasa uh -oh. and he was talking about he had an older brother and I'm like oh is his name Takamasa and he's like actually yes <laughs> and I'm like oh shit like I was seriously just trying to make a joke <laughs> I was like no his name really his older brother's name really was Takamasa bless <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, what? In this whole building? In what? The shape of an L? In case you forget your initials? <laughs> that was uncalled for. <laughs> uh, Sanji wa futokoro kara uh, kinju wo dashita. Sanji pulled a, a pistol from his pocket, or is a handgun from his pocket. Is Umabe just gonna start crying? I kind of Oh my god, you. please. Please just fucking butt cry like a girl. <laughs> Oh, sorry, that's a... Uh, I'm, I'm beyond gendered insults now. It's 2023. <laughs> isn't, isn't, yeah, isn't that kind of... Well, no, it's like... Ki. Yeah, kia is more... This is more like... Uh, and I, I might try this as irk, like E-R-K. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like... Okay. <laughs> siren ga kikoita. Suddenly, you hear sirens. Oh, fuck. Uh, uh, no patoka ga umabe to sanji o hakken, uh, sokodo o, uh, agete koshira ni sekkin shite kuru. Uh, a patrol car out on its rounds had spotted umabe and sanji, uh, and began to speed its way directly toward them. Contents pulled out a pistol from his pocket. Hi! Hello there! Greetings! I'm Sanji the Fox, and I'm going to kill you. Sanji the Fox. He has a gun and he wants to kill a man. So, Ushio, what'll it be? What'll it be? <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly I heard a siren. A patrol car finds Bay and Miyoshi speeding up and approaching us. Oh, Miskata! Shit, they found us. Goki! Goki! Sanji wa ima ima shige ni umabe wa miru. Sanji looked like, uh, like hatefully or like resentfully. And also rocking those boots. Yeah, he gave, he, he sat like a, an annoyed look at like what was it? Aniki, kono mama ja sumane da kara na. And it's like, we're not, we're not done here, boss. Ooh. Like, we're not finished with this. Yeah. Sanji wa satta. Sanji uh, took off. This isn't over. Yeah, this isn't over. This isn't over, boss. Umame mo awatete bits mo michi o nigeru. Umame panicked and ran off down a different road. Oh. This is going to make the things really interesting because then uh, Sanji's going to bump into Ushio proper. 
Oh my god, this is gonna be so, so good. good. Northern Islands, damn, I found it. <laughs> Miyoshi looks at the club frustratedly. Big brother, you can't get away with this. Miyoshi left. Ah! <laughs> and nothing else. And nothing else. Uh, officers left out of the uh, squad car. Like, again, the strength of the photography really sells yeah. these games. I wish there were... See, this is what AI should be for. Is like, right? we need a way to recreate this photograph at a much higher resolution and bring a little more detail in. Yeah, like that's a tool. Like it's 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 not doing the creative part. It's just do, like you you need to come up with the creative vision. Yeah, and then you just need the software to do it. Like that's not that different than rendering, a you know AI or a computer animated scene, right? Yeah. Like that would be like an upscaler. Yeah, yeah, like you're still having the machine do the drawing. Because I've seen the PSP port and it looks terrible. Ugh. Because it's too bad. they they just tried to like upscale these pictures badly. But they didn't, and they didn't have a way to upres them. Yeah, but uh, that was also okay. done like ten plus In years what? ago. Oh yeah, around the time that probably uh, 428 came out. Yeah. So like 2000, mid 2000s. Yeah. Come on in! Come on in there! Look, stop right there! Stop, I say! Stop. Chigao! Chigao, no! Like, no, you've got it all wrong! Gomame wa bakku katate ni naki no gra! And it's like, Gomame, like, cried as he ran with the bag in one hand. <laughs> Poor Umabe. He needs an, he, need, he needs a uh, delicious treat. Oh, come on. Come on, Greg. A warning pops out from the police car. Stop, stop. No, no, no. Oh! What? Wait, wait, wait. It's time. Right. It was Umabe who was on the bike. Oh, my God. That's right. The Mekong. Blaze past. Oh, God. The Mekong. All right. What? Uh, like suddenly uh like as he as he as he came out onto the road uh suddenly a a motorbike blasted by him and knocked him off his feet i like doppel's take it's mikan no jikan mikan no jikan Umai Toshida. Wow. When I got out. Wow. Oh, apparently. Oh, I wonder if um, Discord was trying to tease the sound. <gasps> Soundboard is a thing. Oh my god, hold on. Does this actually work? Uh, how can I add edit keybind? No, crap. So we've got. <laughs> Oh, how do I add to this though? Because I, I could add in like the anime. Wow! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have fun. So, was that coming through on your side, Kevin? It was. Okay, good to know that's a thing. Um, anyway, yeah, I can add anime wow to that if I can find a way to do it. Wow! When I got out into the street, a motorcycle suddenly jumped out and Takabe lost his leg and fell. TZR, he Yamaha. He lost his leg. He lost his footing! Man, Absolute. Marin Einstein. Time. 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 He lost his leg. Fucking A. That's our Greg. Ba -da -ba -da. I think you were translating Yamaha. Yeah. What could that possibly mean? How do you say Yamaha in Japanese? No, Honda! What the? What the hell? There we go. Hey. Yeah, Honda. Helmet uh, so it's, 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 it's
Uh, the rider was clad all in black from their helmet down to their boots. Oh, new character. Yeah. Midori. Mi <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, what's his name? Midoriyama. Yeah, Midoriyama. Yeah. Oh, that would be perfect. Asuku right. helmet. All oh, right, right. Helmetto. Helmetto. Full face no helmetto. Bike ni no toki ni wa kabura nakia ikenai mono. Naka ni wa geisen no taikan deisu game wo suru toki ni kabutte iru mo shamo iru. Tada shi kore wa tsukete mama ginko ya konbi ni haete iku to mazu machigai naku gokai sareru no de chui shimasho. So, uh, a full face helmet, uh, you need to wear one of these if you're going to ride a motorcycle. Uh, there are some, like, fanatics that will go so far uh, as, like, uh, to wear these helmets in arcades when they have, uh, like, the full body racing games. <laughs> Jeez. Like, we actually sit on, like, a bike. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like, however, if you wear this while you go into a bank or a convenience <laughs> store... You're just asking for people to get the wrong idea, so please be careful. <laughs> yes. <laughs> helmet. 30. Full face helmet, what you have to wear. What is this, British? Full face helmet, Full -face what helmet. you have to wear when you ride a motorcycle. Some of them are still want to <laughs> wear it when they are play the experience racing game game in arcades. Or, however, if you walk into a bank or convenience store with this on, you will most likely be misunderstood, so be careful. Full face helmet, what you have to wear. Full face helmet, what you have to wear if you want to ride a motorbike, bike, in it. Yes! <laughs> oh, it's well protective, in it. Haiku, haiku notte! Oh, haiku, haiku notte! It was a woman's voice. It's like, hurry, get on! Ooh, yeah. it? Oh, I just realized like who this is. This is the oh. boss's the boss's daughter. Oh, it's gotta be the one that uh, is with um, y y uh, y y y Yo Chan. Well, c well, no, no, no. Not it's, Yo it's, it's, uh... it's, well, it's it's the one with Umabe because when we're further in the story, around the eleven thirty mark, she, he is with her at the Shiramine uh... Gumi headquarters. I thought the boss. Oh wait, but isn't the boss's daughter dating uh, what's his face? Busybody, yes. Uh, God, what kind of Yohei? Yohei. No, no. Well, yeah. No, well, remember no, Yohei well, gets was... brought in to meet like his girl's dad. But isn't that and... just like a different part of the family? Oh, that's right. He's like. He's one of the business people that works with the Yakuza, yeah. maybe? Man, I'm, I'm not remembering now. Yeah, no, no. He works with the Yakuza. This is yeah. the daughter of the Yakuza's boss. Well, the Shiramine yeah. group's boss. Because right. when well, we were one... looking at a tip that mentioned Umabe, it said, at this time at 11.30, he is with the daughter of the Shiramine group at the Shiramine group headquarters. That's right. They went to, like, the manor house. So if yeah. we hadn't done... Um... Fuck. Ushio's thing first. This would be a total surprise to us. Yeah. But hi. <laughs> he is no principles whatsoever. Yeah. Uh, sure, whatever. The writer was all dressed in black, apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur. Hurry up, get on. Was a woman's voice. Picture. Hey, you're coming, so hurry up and get on. Well, uh, not yet. Not yet. I'm not, lady. Slow down. Whoa. whoa. Uh, without quite understanding what's going on for now, Umabe just uh, got onto the bike behind the woman. Hold on tight. Ano. Um. 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 Zuz. Ikimasu! Here we go! Unsure of what was going on, Umabe sat in the woman's back for the time being. Hold on tight. That's a bit weird. Might want to phrase that better, Greg. Um, let's go. Yay, yeah. look yeah. at him. It was Umabe. I was wrong about it being Sanju, though. Uh, 
あバイクは急発進し、あっという間に警官の姿は見えなくなる。Uh, the bike took off at terrific speed, and before long, the policemen were gone from view. ドマベはどうなっているかは見あ、見当てもつかない。Like, when they couldn't figure out, like, what was going on. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> yep.、Uh, Uh, speed up, I'm just going to speed up. Hold on tighter. Uh oh. The motorcycle suddenly takes off, and in no time, the police are out of sight. Okay, A. A on that、yeah. one. I have no idea what's going on with the department. Wrong. F. Speed up, hold on tighter. D. Oh. Oh, here we go. Okay. そう、うわっ馬辺は慌てて女の腰に手を回した。うわっ馬辺は思わず、uh, 女の胸を掴んだ。So, he panicked and put his hands on her hips, or he unthinkingly grabbed her chest. Okay. Yeah. Well, first of all, let's see what Greg ruins this with.、Uh. Wow! Ricefield B. Wow! Umabe instinctively grabbed the woman's chest. You couldn't have maybe read the other thing, Greg? There we go. Umabe hurriedly puts his hand around the woman's. So, what I think happens is this is going on the predication of B. Right. He puts he puts his hands on a, badon, on a humonga donka. Hu, fuck. Hubon donka、yeah. rose. And then she like swerves and almost hits the orange truck. Yeah, so I think. So yes. let's.、Uh. So I'm pretty sure. I, I want to see what happens. Yeah. A woo guy. Woo ah! 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 Oh, yeah, like she like, was starting to lose her grip on the、uh, steering. The woman failed to turn, on the、uh. to turn the steering wheel. <sighs> Fucking cool. There、man. it is. Yep. Michael a t o r a k u Oh, God. Is this Trucky Truckerson's truck? t o r a k u kara tsumiyoroshi nakadata mikamiri no dumboru wako hanetova stishimata. I'm just sending a message、uh, to Will. Uh, uh, oh, and the brand is Mika Mikam. Oh, nice. It's like three day Mikam. Mika Mikam. Oranges in three days. So, yeah, the,、uh, the bike.、Um, like. Caused the,、uh, a bunch of cardboard boxes full of mandarin oranges to fall from where they were piled on the truck. Hora! Hey! Hey yo! My cabbages! It, It was. Toraku Unta no Untensiri Taraku. Unta wa Chichioya ga Untensi to you Kotomo ate, Kotomo no Koraka, Toraku Untensi ni Naruno ga Yume datta. Uh, Kanbara? Uh, Monta ga daiski, uh, de, uh, ega toraku yaro wa zen series mite iru. Niji sai de, uh, tsuna, what's the only one for tsuma? Hmm? Uh, and then juta. This word is. Saitaisha. Saitaisha. Otokono k o d a f t a r i r u So, uh. Is this a. A real movie series? I need to check. Toraku yaro. Oh, it might be. Uh. <laughs> Maybe not.、Uh, I think this might be a made up thing.、Um, me, I need me look up this name in kanji because I don't. 
It might be Conda, but it might not be, so... Oh, bang, bang, bang. Oh, it's not, not popping up. Uh, oh, give me one second. As I look via pieces, T3 for the little Ksat comedy, and then I for the found it. Yeah, it is. It is Khan and King, but what is it? If I actually Suge Sugehara or Sugewara Ah, Sugawara, Sugawara Bunta. Okay. This is a real guy. Okay. And he is, oh and, and Torakoyaro is a real series literally like truck rascals is what they call it like truck, truck guys truck rascals. so yeah uh, rascals. Toraku... so the truck is a truck driven by toraku unta unta's father was also a truck driver and ever since he was a kid uh it was his dream to be a truck driver as well uh he's a big fan of sugawara bunta who's a japanese actor and he's seen the entirety of the toraku Yero series uh he's 24 years old married and has two sons all right, Greg, do you worst. Truck. A truck driven by the truck demon driver Turaku Unta. Since Unta's childhood, his dream was to become a truck driver, partly because his father was a driver. I love Bunta Sugara and have watched the entire series of the movie Truck Guy. <laughs> I am I am 24 years old and have two mobile boys. Two mobile? What? Where did you get mobile from? <laughs> I have no idea. That just means that he's... He has two kids. He has two kids. Oh but it's, it's nice to know that uh, Fumiyasu has a full-blown mental breakdown because someone accident... Umabe accidentally <laughs> honked someone's boobs. Yes. Like, the man wailed as he, um, like, Shirime is, uh, like, did he, like, side-eyed them as they took off? Like, maybe. Yeah, he gave them, like, a backwards glance as they took off, yeah. From his very punched face. Yeah. The bike sprung off a cardboard box containing oranges that was being unloaded from the truck. Kokora? It's like, wait, watch where you're grabbing. It's like, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, so let's... Let's, let's go back. Yeah, let's go back. So we know, we, we've now seen... Yeah, we saw what happens when, if you go for the booba. The the Hoban Donk Rose, the the uh Donk the Bonk Honaga Gahoogs. Uh Honaga Gahoogs. Which one is it? Uh the middle one. I sent it a picture to Will with We found it. Alright. Alright. Hey Des. Like he panicked and wrapped his hands around her waist. Correct. Uh, uh, she had like a slender curving like hips. Uh, and like he was worried that he would throw off her balance and like cause him to fall off. See? And now we have realived Fumiyasu. Yay. Is it yay? I mean... Cool, I guess we get to see more of him stuck in the room, wondering what he keeps doing to himself. 
Uh, what? Wow! Umave hurriedly put his hands around the woman's waist. I was worried that the woman might lose her balance and fall over because of her slim waist. Wah. Wah. I love it. It's like a Star Wars transition at this point. The woman stopped the bike and cut the engine. Oh, this is the Shiramune house. Yeah, sure looks like it. Yeah. Umabe took his hand off the woman's hips and got off the bike. The woman stopped the motorcycle and turned off the engine. But boo left <laughs> But boo. But boo. I mean, a butt does boo, but. Yeah. Um, uh. But boo. Uh, let go of the woman's waist and got off the bike. Domo, ano, thank you. Um, um, like, if we've made it this far, we should be fine. She's gonna be fucking stunning. The woman also got off the bike. Hello, um, once you've made it this far, you should be fine. The woman also got off the bike. Hundred. My name's 102, mine's 201. Yep. Oh, hello. Helmet or Tori, Atama Fute Nagai Kami, oh, Pasaritoro Sta. She took off her helmet and then, like, shook her head to unfurl her long hair. Hi, I'm Japanese feminine Tom Hiddleston. Oh. Pachirista me ga incho tekina. Uh, um, she had, um, uh, 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 like, sharply impressive, like, eyes and looked to be, uh, around 23 years old. Umabe niwa mataku boy donai. Uh, Umabe had no recollection of her. Yokata, sagashi ni kite. Well, it's a good thing I came looking for you. Uh, she like flashed a smile of relief. Oh, she's out looking for him because she knows. Yeah. That, she knows that, that, that busy hit up body. a jewelry store with Sanji. Yo. Yeah. Also, that he bumped into. Uh, well, Ushio bumped into Busybody last night. Yo. Yeah. Over the height. Yeah. Yes. yes. I took off my helmet, shook my head, and pulled down my long hair. She is a beautiful woman of about 23 years old, with impressive bright eyes. I don't remember anything about the department. Good, come find me. The woman smiled with relief. Yes? No. She me can on my karasu till I extremely loud incorrect bus. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Um, and it's like, I didn't think I was actually going to find you, but I couldn't just stand there and not do- I couldn't just stay and do nothing. So. Oh, really? It's like, was this, like, somebody, like, who, like, from the sh the shooting, like, team that had come looking for him? Oh, he's so fucking dumb, I love him. I, I know, he's great. Arigato. Yeah, saki no keikan tachi wa nan demo nai no. Thank you. I mean, like, not that those cops from earlier were any problem. Boku wa yamashii koto nan te nan demo shite nai na kara. Like, I, I had nothing to be ashamed of. It was just a little bit of a misunderstanding. Anyway, like, you really bailed me out. <laughs> nice. Oh, fuck off, Greg. <laughs> Come on. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Greg, you're a fucking idiot. Come on, you can do better than this. Nope, no, you can't. No, right. You can't. Or, or at least won't. Right. Hmm, I didn't think I would actually find him, but I couldn't stay still. Thank you. 
guess that was just too much. Like, um, like, from the bottom of his heart, like, he, Humabe clasped, uh, her hands. <laughs> Oh no, it's not like that. It's like, sorry to put you through the trouble. Like, what with you being so busy and all? Yeah, it's like, well, I mean, you're the most important person to me, so. Oh, ho, 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 it's like, like, calling me the most important is like a bit, uh, like, is putting it on a bit thick. <laughs> oh my god, he's like the opposite of Ushio to, um, fuck, what's her name? So, like, while, while Ushio is accidentally, like, becoming, you know, the perfect partner. Oh yeah, and then uh, with uh, Michiru. Yeah, with Michiru, Ushio is gonna put the fucking works on this lady, in oh in God. just by being polite, feeling relief from the bottom of his heart. He grabbed the woman's hand. No, <laughs> she's like, no, don't, please don't. Sorry for bothering you. I'm busy. No, he's the most important person. Whom, Greg? Oomst. Whoops the fuck. I thought they don't care. I was like, I'm not teasing. Honky this Like, I mean it. For realsies. The woman's eyes were serious. Ah, arigato. Oh, thank you. Kimi mi tai ne hito ga itte kurete ureshi yo. Like, I'm glad, I'm happy to have someone like you here. Pontoni? Like, really? Oh, yeah. See, he's oh. he's accidentally, like, solidifying Ushio and her's relationship. <laughs> I love this game so much. Ah. Uh, ah, oh, yeah. I'm not kidding you. I'm serious. The woman's eyes were serious. Ah, thank you. I'm glad to have someone like you and nothing else. Come on, cool. Really? Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake, Greg. It's like, so then, like, we can be together forever then, right? Like, well, let me ask, let me just ask you this. Like, I just don't want to be alone anymore. Hi! <laughs> uh, it's like Ushio, like Umabe tried like desperately to like recall like the woman's face from amongst the staff. Makers on no help with our It's like was she one of the makeup assistants? <gasps> right, the makeup staff. No, sort of stylist or like one of the stylists. スタイリスト主に主役クラスの役者が身につける衣装や小物を揃えてコーディネートする人主演の女優は専属のスタイリストを加えている場合が多いそう、so like typically the uh, major roles like the actors in major roles uh, this is like the stylist is the person who coordinates uh, the costumes that they wear and like the props that they uh, have, like their accessories mm -hmm. um, for like leading actresses typically it's, it's very common for them to have their own special stylists okay, yeah yeah, makes sense Yeah, stylist, a person who mainly coordinates the clothes and accessories worn by leading actors, leading actresses often have their own stylists yeah, alright All right. All right. All right. Like, oh, where do I know you from? Oh, come on, Greg. 
then you can stay together forever. I'll ask you from here. Yes. Was, is it the help of makeup or is it the stylist? Greg, you, you're putting in a lot of C effort today. Yeah. <clears throat> Eto Gomen, Kimi wa. I'm so sorry. You are. Oh no. You done fucked up. Kimi da nante ya desu. It's like, ah, don't call me Kimi. Riko te yonde kudasai. Please just call me Riko. Yep, that's her. Yep. Haha. Riko san, shigoto wa? Like, Riko, like, what's, what's your job? Oh no. Uh, my job. Like, oh, I, I haven't been given one yet. Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, no! Like, I've, like, I've been resisting it. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, you. Please call me Rico. Haha, <laughs> Rico-san. What about work? Work? And nothing else. Uh-oh. Rico no hyojo ga kyu ni kuraku natta. Um, Rico's expression suddenly darkened. Demo, konna koto ni naru nara, shigoto demo nan demo shite, anato o taskereba yokatta. But, like, with this is like, it doesn't matter, like, job or whatnot, I'm just glad I was able to save you. Uh, uh, huh? Huh? It's like, I had no idea that you were in that much trouble. Um, yeah. yeah. Oh, no. Oh, about that. <laughs> yeah. Rico's expression suddenly darkened. But if something like this happened, I should have done whatever I could to help you. I didn't know you were in such trouble, Masaka, who is a character now. Oh, for fuck's Masaka sake. Masaka is waking. <laughs> there's, a, there's a late Star Trek The Next Generation episode where uh, mm -hmm. Data gets like taken over by like these, like the all these personalities in this ancient storytelling database. Mm -hmm. And he's like using the holodeck to like transform the Enterprise into like this temple from Masaka, who's like this like ancient sun god from this like lost civilization. It's like Masaka is waking. It is like Jeez. one of the things they keep saying. It's an episode called Masks, which gets really bad reviews, but like I kinda like it. I think it's fun. Also, Perfect. like apparently like Brent Spiner had like no time to like prep and he plays like seven different characters. Oh. And he does a fantastic job with it though. Like Furry Mouse like, says an extremely season seven episode. It is extremely season seven. Season seven is where you get Beverly fucks the candle ghost that was also uh, fucking your grandmother. Was that was that the the season of? <laughs> uh, no, that's the end of season five, beginning of season six. Oh, okay. Uh, we actually, my housemates and I just watched those episodes like a week <laughs> or so ago. We're like, how do these hold up? It's been like twenty five years or something since we've watched these, oh. and it's like. Man, like, there's a lot going on with not a lot to say in those episodes. Where it's like, hey, like, what if, like, Data, like, went back? And, like, like and it's especially the first half. Like, the first half is, like, half of a really cool thought-provoking premise. And then half, like, what the fuck is this? And then... The second, like, because it's a two-part of the bridge seasons, mm -hmm. and so, like, the second half, like, they didn't have an ending when they wrote the first half, and they're like, fuck, how do we end this? And they very clearly had no idea what to do with their setup, because, like, it's super confusing and nothing really makes sense. <sighs> oh, so sorry. <laughs> yeah, and Mark Twain is there. Yeah. Throughout all of it, Mark Twain. Watashi no say that, wa? It's my fault. Naniga? What is? Riko no hitomi ni namida go kanda. Uh, tears welled up in Riko's eyes. Watashi ga chanto tsuiteereba Ushio san ni anna koto wa sase nakatta no ni. It's like, well, if I had been with you, then this never would have happened to you, Ushio. And he's like, oh. Oh no. This guy. Ushio? <laughs> He's fucking just dumbass. Oh my god. 
牛尾さんどうして大勢卑怯なんだって。Like, Ushio さん、why would you rob a jewelry store? <laughs> oh my god. At least now they're getting、it. to the point where they're realizing there are two、yeah. people. Oh my god. It's my fault. Tears welled up in Rukio's eyes. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's see if we can get a better read on that. It's my fault. What? Tears welled up in Rukio's eyes. If I had followed you properly, I wouldn't have let Ushio Sen do that. 12 OC, the shittier version of 10 CC. Ushio Sen, why are you doing a jewel? <laughs> why are you what, doing what, 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 Why did you do a jewel robbery? Why, why are you doing a jewel robbery? Why are you done did a jewel thief? Did you done that? Who done that? Did you done that? You done. Ch 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 no, no, I, I, I didn't. <laughs> Yeah, super swear. Saki, Chichikara Kita, I heard about it from my father earlier. Tashi mo, itemo tati mo irerakte. And like, I, I had to do something. And like a real 23 year old, you brought him to the place that would kill him instantly. Great job.、Oh. Great job, Rukio. Rico. Rico. Can I? Boko, nani mo stay nainda. It's like, I didn't. I haven't done anything. It's like, please, Ushio, tell me the truth. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, come on, Greg. We've got to get better reads out of you.、Uh, no, 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 you're wrong. I just heard from my father. I didn't do anything, please. Ushio san, tell me the truth. Oh. I like oh, that it read、shit. it backward. Oh, my God, it did. Yeah. What the hell, Greg? Stay night! Stay night! Like, I didn't do anything! I didn't! Boko on Bushis! Like, I'm innocent! Ten to ten. Nande Boko ga? Why would I. Mo Taskite yo! Please help me! Nuabe wa. Nagibe so kaku. Like. Uh, like. He like he, he like scrunched his face up like almost in tears. <laughs> I like Please help I, me. I really hope this is the one character he can tell I am not this guy you think I am.、Oh, and then he explains、God. the whole thing. And then、great. she's like a really badass like backup character. But Ushio san. Uh If you haven't done it, you haven't done it. I'm innocent. Why am I? Help me now. Umabe cried. Mr. Ushio. Tors. Tors. Ruiko, I kinari umabe o a chikara ipe da kishimeta. Ruiko suddenly hugged Umabe for all her might. Oh, she. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> I believe you. I, I won't doubt you anymore. The entire world is stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Ushio san no koto wa otashi wa kanarazu no mote misemasu. I promise I'll keep you safe, Ushio san. Ushi. It's like, I, I can't breathe. So yo, mo dari ni mo watasanai. Like, that's right. Like, I won't let anyone else have you. Like, her eyes burned with passion. <laughs> I mean, her heart's in the right place for the wrong person. I know. Rico suddenly gave Takabe a hug.、Oh, I believe! I won't doubt you anymore. I will definitely protect Ushio san. I won't give it to anyone else. To oh, sorry. I won't give it to anyone anymore. Rico's eyes lit up. Her eyes were lit. Ushio san, ato wa tashi ne makasete kudasai. Ushio san, please just leave the rest to me. Oh god. Do, do what are you what gonna, gonna do? do? <laughs> <laughs> Good question. Yappari, ima wa otosan no tokoro ga ichiban anzen da to moon desu. Like, 
I think the, the safest place for you right now is my father's house. Oh, oh no. Oh, where the guy lives. Oh, oh yeah. That's right. right. That's right, Jay. That sounds awesome. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to do some drugs, Larry? Umabe wa toriaizu hanashi wa wasete oku. For now, Umabe decided to go along with her. Oh, he has no yeah. idea what he has just put himself into. Mr. Ushio, please left, leave, leave the rest to me. After all, it's safest to be... Hold on, let's see if we can... There we go. Mr. Ushio, please leave the rest to me. What are you going to do? Let's keep the story together for the time being. Fifth. It's going to plead the fifth. The fifth. But, let's Dude, take... What's the... Let's take a fiver. Okay, so we'll be let's back in about... Let's take a short break earlier today, and we'll do the long break later. Okay, so we'll be back in about hey, six, seven past the hour. Going to yeah. run some ads, and we'll be back with more translator's notes. Woohoo! show. show.
Camera, action. Good show. Yo, so sorry we we're a little later than we said we'd be uh, for our break, but uh, it's not all a loss. I learned something more about the uh, Rakuyaro series oh. while I was gone. And apparently, like, the formula for those movies is, like, he's, like, this, like, trucker guy. Mm -hmm. He rolls into town, and then he meets and falls in love with a woman who he then later has to help romance another guy huh so that's definitely happening in this game right no. <laughs> that's definitely like going to be a thing that goes on with this hey will hey welcome will yeah we 
We, we, we avoided the Mandarin Orange fate. It turns out, don't be a creeper and grab a woman on the boobs when you just met her and she's trying to save your life. I mean, it's not so much he was a creeper, it's just he made a poor choice. He made a... He... he, he I don't think... Yeah, I, I don't think Uma's a creeper. I think he's just... He's not all... He's a bit clumsy. That's right. Also, hey, sir, I like to appreciate the braid. Hey! I hope, I hope Sonic 06 was worth it. Oh, my God. I... I worked on the game, it wasn't... I'm in the special, thanks. <laughs> thanks for nothing. I just love... It never is worth it. It never is. Like, I just... Like, aren't you worried about meeting him? Uh, Uh... And it's like, do you put it in our life? I is it up in I? And then, yeah, so you put it in our life. Hmm. One second. Wow. I don't know if you yeah, this is like uh Oh and it's like And it's like sorry so you put the and it's like Oh it's never it's like oh it's never been an option. Like <laughs> Right. I've never had the opportunity. Like he had no idea who her father was, but it was certainly better than getting caught up by either Sanji or the Shiramine Gumi. Oops. Oops. Oops, old Shiramine Gumi. Alright then, let's hurry. That would be a great episode title. Oops, or Shirame Nagumi. Oops, Oh, come on. Oh, oh Salix says he thinks he's, he's like, I thought I saw you in the credits. He probably did. Yeah. Uh, no, he pointed it out the other week. He was asking what my name was in the credits. I'm like, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm not that. <laughs> that is not my world, unfortunately. Yeah. Except for 428, very, very briefly. Uh. All right. Well, I would have gotten your name in the credits for 428, but I don't even have my name in the credits for 428, so, you know. Yeah. We had to work to get you on the uh, listed on IMDb for that. You so know, you the game that's all text that I'm somehow not in the fucking credits for. Anyway, I'm not bitter. Well, now that it's 2023 and IGDA yeah. apparently cares 20, about 23 that now. 23 and me. <laughs> 23 and me. We've looked at the DNA of this game and we can detect your work in it. Ruiko wa akuri akuriti te bike ni matagari helmet o kabuta. Uh like Rika said with like brightly as she straddled the bike and donned her helmet. Wait, wasn't 23 and me a story you wrote about a dude who has a romance with his reflection? What? No. You, you, you know, <laughs> this is 23 of me now. Oh my god. <laughs> Funnily enough, I was remembering an old story I wrote earlier today. Uh -huh. to a guy who's like at work and this person he's just imagining is there like in his cubicle, like on his desk, like flirting with him and teasing him. And he's like, you can't be doing this. It's like, I'm not even real. You're just imagining me here. You're making me do this, not me. Give, anyway. Give it New Zealand accents and it's perfect. Can't be doing this. Ah, uh, no, I think he maybe already did. Did what? <laughs> did what? I said I think he maybe did. <laughs> uh oh. Alright. Both are not the Please get on. Rico brightened up, got on the bike, and put on a helmet. Please go ahead. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> Onigashimas. Alright. This is Please. a look of a man 
who thinks he is about to have an end to his nightmare, and it's only going to get worse over the next four days. Was it three at this point? Oh, oh my god, it's going to be so good. Uh, he put his uh, arms around your waist. Yes, please. yes, please. Please take me away from here, mommy. Sean, yes, Sean, yes, please. Uh, Umabe no setaru ruiko no bike wa nan pai nan no uh kokyu uh shiutaku gai o susunde ita. Uh, Ruiko's bike with uh Umabe aboard. Uh, pass through a high-end residential district in Nampedai. Hmm. Hold on. Nampedai is the part of Shibuya where the big rooftop confrontation with uh, Kano and uh, Tateno takes place. Oh! Yeah. And then, like, you have the thing where, like, Midori Kawa just gets, like, handcuffed just to the railing. To, like, yeah. the railing. And then, like, <laughs> Kano never comes back. Like, <laughs> Kawa's just stuck there and he never gets to finish the game. <laughs> oh man, I miss 428. I gotta play that yeah, game. Yeah, yeah that, that that was in Nampedai. A child's motorcycle with a flat part on it was going. What? No. No, wrong. A child's motorcycle with a flat part on it was going through the upscale residential area of Nampedai. Well, they got Nampedai right, an upscale yeah. residential area. That's about well. it. What are you talking about? Things up people's butts, say, like. Hey, that's hey, what we talk hey, about, hey, not hey, you. Oh. Yeah, you're supposed to be the precious golden boy. The boy, the boy who dragons. Wow, uh, I really, wow, well, I, yeah, re I really set that one up. Fucking I was gonna say, as somebody who, in addition to just being a furry, I'm also on a lot of D and D forums and stuff. The idea of dragons and butts goes beyond just weirdos like us. Really. It's universal. Oh, that's oh, the cool idea of the, the idea of the bard seducing the dragon is like one of the like uh, like baseline D and D jokes. Huh. Horny bard seduces the dragon, and then it's like, all right, bend over. It's like, wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not I meant the other I way. Yeah. Run, run tell that. Yeah. Roll, roll for save. D and D. Yeah, roll, yeah. Roll, roll, roll con save. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, well, the dragon's a top, so I hope you're ready. D&D yeah, &D is full of monster fuckers. fuckers. It totally is. That seems like it should be a shirt. I'd wear it. Maybe. Uh, finally, Ruiko stopped the bike outside of a large gate. It's been about half a year since I've been home. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh wow. So busybody, um, was it Yama? Fuck. It's not Yamabuki. Was it Yama? It was Yama. Yamabu Yamabuki. Buki. Yamabuki has been like, oh, I will entice the the patriarch's daughter. Oh ho ho! And she oh, hasn't oh. been here for like. Half a year, year half and a half. Half a year, year, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's kind of creepy. All right. <laughs> oh my god! Furry Mouse says, "I saw someone refer to the monster manual as the husband catalog." <laughs> it's like your your grinder best bet. Oh, swipe left. Oh, how does that work? Oh, oh said Dio. Oh my god! Speaking yeah. Dio. You can you can be Dio in Tears of the Kingdom. I'm not gonna say oh how, God. but you can you can basically be like Star Platinum of the world. Ah, uh, and I need to find a way to put that sound effect in the game, like the best sound effect ever created for anime, which is like, hey, can we get like a really wibbly squishy noise and like time reversing? Uh, the world. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love where he's like. Well, I've tried everything else. Why isn't it working? Oh, so that's what that feels like. <laughs> Umabe wa sodomo wo miyageru. Uh, Umabe looked up beyond the gate. Sukashi wa natsukashi. Isn't it a little nostalgic there? Like, doesn't it take you back a bit? 
それルイコが嬉しそうに聞いた。Uh, asked really happily. そうだね。Yeah, yeah sure. sure does. <笑> mm-hmm. Yep, sure does. <笑> oh. So, wait, what's the thing that Dio says? It's like Tokyo Tomeru, right? Tokyo Tomare. Tomare, yeah. yeah. So, like, I want that with, like, the. Alright, Greg. Fuck this shit. Hit it, Josuke! Can、hit it, Josuke! <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck is Kakuin? <laughs> <clears throat> Eventually, Rico stopped her bike in front of a large gate. It's been a, a half a year since you've returned. Are you a little nostalgic? Rico asked happily. すぐに開きます。It'll open in a moment. しかし、すごいもんが組まれたね。トラックが突っ込んでも変わりそうもないな。It's like, man, like, that's a pretty like, impressive gate. Like, I bet like, a truck wouldn't even be able to bust its way through. Not one. No. Not one ridden by one truck driver. Oh my god. God, like, did we ever decide how to localize that name other than like, no. truck driver or. Something like that. Chuck Driver or something. Chuck D. Chuck D. River. Chuck D. River. Like Chuck Driver. I, I, I,、right? I, I, I like Ch- Chuck Driver because it's not、yeah. really super leaning into it, but it's pretty close. Yeah. Chuck D. Head. Maybe you can, maybe you can spell Driver with a Y, like D R Y V E R. Just call him Adam Driver. Adam Driver. Getting some nachos! Ugh. Oil is not for the weak. Only the strong may suckle at mother's teeth. <laughs> Ara, Tate, Jisani, Sane, my no Tokiwa, Aro, uh, Daijobu, that Tanjan, I just call. Uh, and it's like, oh, yeah, like, that was like three years ago, and it was fine. <sighs> oh, it's like not working for her. Uh, uh And it's like, man, like, I bet, like, a truck wouldn't even be able to, like, drive its way through this. And it's like, well, yeah, like, it was fine after that thing three years ago, remember?、Uh... It's like somebody did try to, like, drive a truck through、and、the Yakuza Ushio, boss's Ushio game. Ushio had to take care of it. Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, oh, my God. See,、mm-hmm. uh, say, like, the cool thing with Decap Attack is that in Japan. It's actually、oh. an anime license game for like a real anime in the 80s. It was like Turbo Hat Adventures or something. And it's completely different. Well, the, ge- the core gameplay mechanics are the same, but it's like based around this weird anime in the 80s. Chuck D. Blowy. <laughs> That's right. So I, I blew for friend of the show, Ray Far, who hasn't been around. Oh, he, he's at a furry convention this weekend. He's at the one in.、Uh... Australia. The, Australia has a furry <laughs> convention this weekend, too. Um, um,、yeah. I think it's Furdo. Something. Like Fur Down Under.、Um, but、uh, there's a thing where someone's like, hey, if you didn't know, there's an episode of the old Spider Man cartoon that it's about the Green Goblin. And it's, it's called Gobby on Ice. <laughs> but Gobby on Ice in Australian slang means blowjob on meth. <laughs> And I sent it to Ray Far and he lost his shit. He's like, oh my god. <laughs> Now that's something I wish I had known when I was writing Marine the Raccoon. <laughs> I'm gonna have a gobby on ice. Yeah, it's like when you get like, the, the,、uh, the fucking hovercraft and go on the ice. Yeah, let's go and have a gobby on the ice, mate. And then just send that to the ESRB and they'd have no idea. Oh. <laughs> hey, scientists, if you can invent、yeah. a time machine, we have a very specific gag we want to destroy all the time and space with. <clears throat> so, like,、uh, I streamed it once, and Decap Attack is not listed as a game you can play, but it recommends Turbo. Yeah, Turbo. It's like、uh, Turbo Hat Die Vulcan or something. This is like Turbo Hat Big Adventure or something. Yeah. All right, Greg, ruin this thing. Magical Hat no Butobi Tabo. That's the one. Yeah, Magic Hat's Turbo Fight. <laughs> oh, yeah, Magical Hat is a. Oh, it's Studio Piero. Yeah, yeah. The、um, like, Yusei Itsura people. Yeah. And、uh, later on,、um, 
They also did Yu Yu Hakusho. And, uh, fuck, what's it? Uh, the... Bleach? No, 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 no. It's like more recent. They did do Bleach. Um, uh, oh, uh... Matsu-san. Fuck. Uh, I keep thinking of the joke maybe they put in it, Kusumatsu-san. Uh, you know the one I'm talking about. Tokyo it's like Goro? Koromatsu, Yonamatsu. Uh, oh! The old gag manga. Why is that yeah. so um... Osumatsu san. Yeah, Osumatsu kun, yeah. Well, no, it's awesome. So the the get the drug oh. with the new version is that they're also Now it's Osumatsu, Osumatsu, Osumatsu san. san. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. They did like the whole thing where they start off in the Showa era anime and it goes off the rails and now they can't You're broadcast right. that anymore because they broke a lot of copyright problems. Uh <laughs> It will open soon. However, the gate looks amazing. Even if a truck crashes into it, it doesn't like it's going to break. Greg, Greg, come on. I hate that it's Boruto subtitle Naruto the movie. Boruto or Bol. Yeah, Disney already did that, Japan. Bleach Memories of Nobody. <laughs> That's an indictment of the fucking series, isn't it? <laughs> well, that was the thing I always joke with Kyo. Like, Bleach is like, how is it every time I see you watching Bleach, someone is, like, just bleeding from their mouth? <laughs> it's just the thing in Bleach. See, Will's got it. Fuck, what's it? it sounds like a great British insult. Oh, so in fuck, it. In it. Oh. Yashiki no Shui imo ganjol, ganjol so na concrete no shit. That's a hiki? No, that's not hiki. That's um. Isn't that like okay? Was that hiki? No, no, that's hiki. Uh, okay. It's a uh, okina hei. It's not hiki. Yeah, okina hei ga concrete no hei ga gururi to. Uh, so it's like the the mansion was surrounded by a sturdy looking concrete uh wall uh that like unwrapped it and he couldn't get a look at what was going on inside dude i'm so mad they've got a fucking denture to, to go machine at fwa uh oh do they and as usual the alcoholics are like is this like the Japanese desert bus? Who hasn't said, gee, I'd really like to drive and communicate? Like, I had to just explain. Like, you have no idea how big this game is. Like, it's so big, they actually prototyped an English version at Dave & Buster's last year. Oh my god. And by the time I was able to serendipitously go to that Dave & Buster's, it had already moved on. Uh Man, anytime I have to go to the Metroplex, if at all possible, I fly in and out of Love Field. Because fuck DFW. Oh, right. No, I get like, that. Hello, you have landed at Terminal A. Your connecting flight is in 12 minutes. It'll be physically impossible for you to reach Gate F before your plane leaves. Welcome to DFW. You're fine. It's just like, why? I mean, in fairness, O'Hare pulls that shit, too. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, I've been there. It sucks. Sorry. Sorry, Chicago. I love Chicago in theory, but your airport yeah. sucks. Especially when you're ill and you have to run from one terminal to another to make your flight. Uh, there was no nameplate dis uh, displayed anywhere. Hey, Will, since you're in the chat, if that's the, uh, Gilsatsu, that, that, those, the fourth line there, that's first two kanji, that's the, the type of nameplate that I sent you a picture of the other day. Gilsatsu, that's what it's called. Yeah, so Gilsatsu, it's like your nameplate that you put outside your house. But they're the Yakuza, so they don't have one. <laughs> <laughs> totally normal house. Yeah. Uh, hey, no job, uh, you, you, she, uh, Tessen, uh, got, uh, Harime Grasete Iru. Hold on. It's gotta tell us what this is. You, she, Tessen. 
Ah, uh, barbed wire. Is what that means. Ah. Oh. Yushi Tessen. The, like, animated series oh. with Pamela Anderson. Uh, entertainment K no process uh, dantai de uh, ring rope uh, Ring rope kawari ni tsukawareru uh, Toge no aru uh, tessen uh, Barasen uh, Kore ni uh, denryu o uh, nagashitari uh, Kayaku o shikomu no ga Ippan teki na tsukai kata uh, Hoka ni koji uh, Genba ya uh, Shiyuji naro no tachiri kinchi kuiki No shui ni uh, so, uh, in, uh, for, in, like, entertainment, uh, 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 um, so, uh, the pro like the process teams in entertainment they use uh, this in place of uh, ring rope uh, it's the uh, with the thorny like wires known as like rose wire um, this can be used to uh, transmit uh, like electrical current or uh, they can be fitted with uh, like gunpowder or like uh, like explosives um that's like a sort of thing uh additionally these are all they're also used by like construction sites and private residences uh in order to keep people out of areas they are not allowed in i didn't realize barbed wire was used in entertainment purposes well depends on the kind of entertainment i suppose barbed wire Barbed wire, barbed wire, barbed wire is used in place of ring ropes in professional wrestling. Oh, wrestling! Oh, pro Wait, pro wrestling! Pudo Resu! Pudo Resu, that's Dude, there was okay, a whole yeah, thing yeah, about yeah. that in 428, right? Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah. There's a bit in it, and I've uh, never seen The Wrestler. Yeah. yeah so, yeah, yeah, you can, like, yeah, like in wrestling, they'll they'll have, like, the cage matches. Yeah, with, Rage, like, in, the, Rage the, in the Cage. Yeah, that's what they're talking about. Pro, uh, okay, I, I saw Pudo, Pudo Resu. Yeah, Pudo Resu. Um, barbed wire is used in place of ring ropes in professional wrestling groups in the entertainment industry. They are also set up around restricted areas such as private property, where wrestling also kind of takes place. Yeah. See also that clip of Yakuza with Kiryu and the other guy by the microphone while everyone else fights. Uh, or the scene where Ryuji just punched his own dad out. Right. We're like, oh, this is gonna lead to a bad end. No, it's not. Oh, no, like, oh, that's okay. just Ryuji. <laughs> that's, that's literally every Ryuji beat. The, like the first time where he killed like the Castle crew, and they're just like, oh fuck, I gotta get out of here. We were determined that was gonna be a bad end, but nope, that was a Sutsuku. Oh. <clears throat> mm -hmm. oh, he's only just noticed the barbed wire. The mansion is also surrounded by sturdy looking concrete walls, so you can't see what's going on inside. The nameplate was not hung anywhere. The top of the wall is covered with barbed wire. TA J1001. It's a robot asking for a one. Asking for a. A gobby. A gobby on ice. Gobby on the rocks. Gobby on the rock. There you no, go. that's if you do crack. Fuck. Oh, God. <laughs> Uh, atop the gate was a surveillance camera that was fixed pointedly at them as if like staring. Are you sure the, the this isn't like Buckaroo Banzai's place? Dude, what was, Uma Bay! Uma Bay! What was the fucking name of like all their rangers they had? They had like a oh. name for like all the ranges they had. Oh fuck! I gotta watch Buckaroo Manzai again. I love that movie. 
like the first time I saw it, I hated it and I didn't understand anything. And then a friend explained it to me, and like I'm like, Hong Kong Cavaliers. Well, no, no, the Hong Kong this Cavaliers was the band, oh, the band. but That's they had right. like a name for like all the people who supported Buckaroo. It's like either uh... something Ranger, and like there was like some old guy and his kid. Uh, I got a uh, dude. If you've never seen Buckaroo Banzai across the eighth dimension, it oh is one of the greatest movies ever made. I've never seen it not completely shit face out of my mind. <laughs> like every I've, time I've seen it, every time I see it, I'm like just super drunk, and I don't even get drunk that often anymore. Like I enjoy it sober. Like I hated oh, it no, the first it time, great. and then and then a friend explained to me what was going on because they were a fan of it from the eighties, and I'm like, oh, and they went back into it, and I'm like, oh, this makes total sense to like five people, <laughs> and that's why we have the ending that we do for um, uh, the Life Aquatic, but that's right. where that comes from. The black electrodes and the red electrodes, right. yeah. yeah, and uh, John Big Boute. Bute. Bute. Home. Home is where you wear your hat. John John M. Dahl. Where um, Lord John Warfen. A very young um guy who is in Breaking Bad is in that. The guy who's the ex cop is like the guy who runs the uh psychiatric home. Oh and Clancy Brown is also in it. Yeah, no, he's um uh, Rawhide and he gets nope. killed. Yeah. Uh, surveillance cameras are set up everywhere uh, set up above the gate and they keep their eyes fixed on this and it's also a rumor that like Big Trouble in Little China started off as a sequel script to Buckaroo Banzai because the guy who directed it wrote the script for uh, Big Trouble and like you can oh, kind okay. of you can kind of see the similarities where you've got like David like what was Big Troubles it was like David L Lopan, right? Yeah, David Lopan, yeah. And so the villain in Buckaroo Banzo is called Hanoi Jean. Oh. Yeah. Like, you could see it being a Buckaroo uh. Banzo script. Uh-oh. Almost everything in the Buckaroo Banzai writer's script, other than Lopan, was changed, apparently. Mm-hmm. What it needed wasn't a rewrite, but a complete overhaul. It was a dreadful screenplay. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love that movie. God, I would never seen it a couple of years ago. Oh, dude, like... we we finally introduced Lockheed to it, and it was like the best thing he had ever wow. seen that year. And that was just before he went to Korea. South Korea. Uh, now, yep. now he knows how to tame the burning blade when he gets there. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> well, that that was also just before he went to Korea. Before we thought we were about to go to war with North Korea. Oh, right. Yeah, like Lucky's words were like, "Y'all don't know how really close we came to that." <laughs> he had to sign his will when he arrived in South Korea that year. Thanks, Trump. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. I see a meow in. That means two women. Eyes of green. Hey, what do they mean? Uh. 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 Yeah, Tainai. Tainai, eight Susamiru. So, yeah, like the, the door, the gate open inwardly. Uh, Riko, uh, like, like, drove the bike onto the grounds. Oh. Uh, the gate opened inward. The child advances the motorcycle into the mansion. Not into the mansion, just onto the manor grounds. A child. <laughs> Her name is Rico. Rico, it's right there. Kirai Yashiki Nai no Hidarite Oku ni Okina Nikai Date no Yashiki ga 
uh, uh On the left inner side uh, of the vast estate grounds was a large two-story uh, manor house. That it is a was large old. home. It is old as fuck, but it is pretty yeah. as fuck. Uh, from the outside, the place gave off the impression of being a fortress, but uh, the manor itself was in like pure classic Japanese style. Yeah. A large Nisaki style mansion can be seen in the back left of the spacious site. From the outside, it gave the impression of a fortress, but the mansion itself was purely Japanese. That doesn't really give us much context in yeah. English, but sure, whatever. Also, it's not Niseki style, it's, it's Ikai Date, which just literally is a two story building. <laughs> Oh, no. uh, the bike came all the way up to the outside the front entryway when suddenly a large group of men came out and promptly lined up. Uh, yeah. N what the? Yeah. Like, none of these guys looked like normal fellows. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and it's God. like, welcome home, mistress. <laughs> oh, no. The men shouted in unison. When the motorcycle came to the front of the entrance, a large number of men suddenly appeared from inside and lined up. What? What is? All the men have unusual faces. Welcome home, young lady. The men shouted in unison. Da, Mark. Da, da, she is home. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Joel's song. Oh, oh lady. yeah. Th this feels like it's uh. a good. Riko wa tokotachi ni chisaku unazeita. Riko gave the man a slight nod. Ma, masaka. Like, no wait, are, are you? <laughs> 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 Like, Umabe's like cheeks drew back tightly. Like, oh, no. oh. Great. he's in the fist bite phase. Yeah. Oh. Uh, the men seemed surprised at the sight of, <laughs> of Ushio clinging tightly to Riko. Or yeah, they, yeah, they. Well, because they think it's Ushio, yeah. Well, oi, do you call that? Wait, 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 what's the meaning of this? Usolaro? No way. Ah. <laughs> uh, yeah, because they think it's Ushio, but Ushio quit the, yeah. the game. Yeah. Oh, young lady. Rico nodded slightly at the man. Well, no way. Mabe's cheeks twitched. The men also showed a surprised expression when they saw the club clinging to Rico. Oh, hey, what are you talking about? <laughs> so, like, not a fan of that. It's like, what's the matter, Ushio? We're here. Domo, uh, thanks. Umabe like, with his legs trembling underneath him, Umabe got off the bike. Oh no! <laughs> oh, come on. Come on, Greg. You can do better than this. What's wrong, Gyuma-san? We've arrived. Wow, you did do worse. Oh no. Atokore, onegai ne. Take care of this, won't you? Like said Rico to a man with a long face. Ah, like, what are you doing with her? Uh, 
Uh, the long-faced man seemed much more concerned with Umabe than the bike. <laughs> oh, come on. There we go. And this, please, Rico said to the man with the long face. Ah, uh, um, why are we... Why are you with the young lady? It seems the men with long faces are more interested in clubs than motorcycles. What the fuck, Greg? It's Greg, you're just shitting that. Come on. <laughs> oh, Rico, I can't even see the face of the guy who was in the Rico suddenly smacked the long face, man. I like her already. Yeah. You okay now? Say what I am. It's like, mind your own business. It's like, I shouldn't have to explain that to you, should I? <laughs> oh, he's gonna tell fucking busybody. Uh, maybe. Yeah. It's like the the de like the the hitherto like sweet and delicate like Rico like now spat out like caustic words like fire. Oh, I like that. She's yeah, dragon. She's it. just spitting fire. She's spitting fire. Rico suddenly slapped the man with the long face. It's a necessary help. I have. To Another child suddenly slapped a man with a long face. It's a necessary help. I have to explain it to you. Ah, oh, goddammit. Alright. Umabe wa totan o nukarete komate shimate iru. It is like Umabe was like frozen stiff with uh, like the shock of like. It's so sorry. It's like it's just that the 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 boss has been look, looking for him for a while now. So, it's like right, and I have to talk to my father as well. Oh. Oh. Ah, 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 said Yoshi. The department is stunned and frozen. Do you have something to talk about with your father, too? Come on, Greg. There we go. Shh, sorry, I've been looking for the boss since a while ago. Well, you're not very good lackey, are you, then? Triple Goki. Triple Goki. Oh, he just figured it out. He's like, oh, shit. This I is was like... trying to get away from the Yakuza, and I did the opposite of that. No, I'm balls deep in it. Oh, uh, you are so many, like, uh, <laughs> my man, I am sorry. Right. Like, all the blood drained from Uma's face. Oh, the best. Let's go, Ushio. I don't want it. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> yes? Yes. 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 the 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 boss right now. <laughs> oh come on! What a mistake! The face the, the face of the triple go key part lost blood. Let's go, Mister Ushio. Ah, um, yes. Oh, come on, Greg. Fucking. Don't worry. Like, I'll, I'll speak to my father. Come along. Rico walked off toward the entrance. So, And there, for the first time, Ushio's eyes alighted on the big uh, name plaque. 
<laughs> sure, I mean, uh, yeah. He finally saw the name. Don't worry, I'll tell my father. Come on. Rico started walking towards the front door. There, for the first time, large a large nameplate caught Umabi's eye. Wah. Yep. <laughs> no. <laughs> so what? Uh, yeah, uh, Shiramine, oh. East Kanto Shiramine yeah. Group, leader for yeah. Shi Shimi? Shimi Shimichi Shiramine. Oh. So I don't think that's Shimichi. I think that's... Uh... I think it's Taramichi. Yep. Oh my god. It's beautiful. Oh, he's in so much trouble. <laughs> I love it to sit to get. Sit to get. Oh. But we know how to resolve that one at least. Yeah. But we have all these other lucky lucky all these other fun things. Yeah, right. So we've done Ishio, we've done Umave. We've. Oh. At some point, we'll continue. We'll have to go Fumiyasa back to Fumiyasa at some point. point. Um, We've got Kema. Uh, so, what time is Kema at? Uh, where we left him, where someone's about to run out. So, him. he's at 10.50. Okay, so we ha we have the jump to Kema at 10.50. Mm -hmm. uh, who else do we have that's where there stops? Um, we, have, we have Uma at 11.20. No one's going to get to Yoshiko yet, because she's like... Yeah, Yoshiko's pretty far in, yeah. So we still got to stop Masaki Oh, we haven't done Masashi Yohei. yet at all. Masashi or Yohei. Or Yohei. Uh, uh, yeah. Let's, uh... Do we want to do the second of the seven societies? Yeah, hell yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Oh, his face makes more sense now. When we select that. Oh, that's right. He got super drunk and got... Yo... Masashi ga yobugi koe yatte kuru to rojin wa benchi ni koshi o roshite hato ni mame o maite ita. When Masashi got to Yoyogi Park, there was an old person on the bench uh, feeding like seeds to the birds. I the wonder doves. if that's um, Mr. Moe. Oh, maybe. When Masashi came to Yoyogi Park, the old man was sitting on a bench and scattering beans on Heto. Hato, Hato, it means Hato. dove. Oh. Oh, so it's... Oh, it's Thursday. Yeah. So do, uh... Oh, it was Thursday, yeah. Yeah, he's the guy who's like, Chinchikoru! Chinchikoru! <laughs> 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 Masashi wa mokuyobi no tonari esu atta. Masashi sat down next to Thursday. Like, would we even localize Chinchikoru or just sort of keep it there? I, yeah, yeah, it needs, like, yeah, because it sounds funny, Chinchikoru. Yeah. It was Thursday. Chinchikoru. Chinchikoru. Masashi <laughs> sat next to Thursday. Oh, kita na, kinyobi ko. Uh, you made it Friday. Hi. Hi. Masashi wa kono shinanui rojin ga naze ka suki datta. For some reason, um, Masashi liked this refined older man. Oh, he's gonna be a shit. Oh, I, know, I bet. Kita yo, kino wa taista o tegara datta rashi. It's like I heard yesterday sounds like it was quite the handful. <laughs> Yet, so the whole demo. Ah, no, it wasn't that bad. Suzuki Soda. It's like, well, let's. Uh, like, apparently, there's. Like, it seems like there's more for you. Hmm. Huh? Oh, you're here, Friday Khan. I heard. It seems that yesterday was a big achievement. No, not so much. It looks like it will continue. Not a great read, Greg. Yeah. Shichiyo kaika sa, 
君はあの想像がいいらしい。ああ、it's like within the seven si、uh, the seven day society。it's like it seems like you you've got a you're a good fit。やってみるかね。want to give it a shot。木曜日は鳩の豆を分けてくれた。ああ、Thursday like ah、uh, like portioned out the the beans for the doves。前の金曜日は長続きがしなかった。Like、the, the previous Friday didn't stay on very long. あ、huh? あ。あ、初日からあつまずいてしまってね。It's like he, he stumbled up. He stumbled pretty hard on his first day. 木曜日は笑った。Uh, Thursday smiled. Or laughed. It's a seven day party. He seemed to get along well. I'll give it a try. On Thursday, he shared the pigeon beans with me. <laughs> no! Ew. Gross. Last Friday, they didn't. Pigeons don't、month. have beans, they have talons. <laughs> well, I mean, I've seen.、Um, fuck, what do they call them? In HEB, they don't call it chicken feet, they call them chicken paws. And I hate it. Uh huh. I stumbled from day one last Thursday. Wow. なぜか金曜日は長続きしない。Uh, so, like, yeah, for some reason he didn't stick on very long Friday. 私が聞いてからでも君は呼んだ。Uh, it's like, oh, なぜか金曜日は、uh, like, for some reason Fridays don't seem to last long.、Hmm. Uh, 私が聞いてからでも君は、uh, 4人目だ。It's like, you're the first, you're the fourth Friday since I've joined. 日曜日は君を偉く買っている。And it's like Sunday, like, like, must really, like, see a lot of value in you. Like, 三人の人たちはどうなったんですか It's like, well, what happened to the other three? Ah. <laughs> 木曜日はちょっと、uh, 遠くを見る目をした。Like, Thursday looked off somewhat into the distance. 君は何と言われたね And it's like, what have you been told? はあ Let's try this one. There we go. For some reason, Fridays don't last so long. What happened to the three of you? Oh, Thursday looked a, far, looked a little far into the distance. Huh? What did they say to you? Huh?、Oh, Greg, you're not doing great. 日曜日にさ、命令通りにしないとどうするかと。ああ、え、it's like、like what did what did Sunday tell you? It's about what happens if you don't、uh, follow her orders. え、それはつまり、well、ああ、それはすべてを何もかもバラすと。I guess she said she'd basically expose everything. そうされたのさ、金曜日くん。And that's what happened to them Friday, Kun. Oh. Uh, to the three guys who quit. Oh.、Uh, Masashi was on the Sunday in the Koto Omota. Masashi thought about the other three. On Sunday, it's all about, every it's about everything at last. That's right. Friday, you quit. Three people. Masashi thought about that again. Greg, no. Come on. だが、君は大丈夫そうだ。You look like you'll be alright, though. 父親会の期待も大きい。The Seven Day Society has big hopes for you. マサシは聞いた。マサシ asked. あ。そう、父親会の目的は何です Like, what is the goal of the Seven Day Society? 父親は誰が作ったんですか Who made the Seven Day Society? <laughs> 父親会って父親会のことですか So it's like the Seven Day Society, it's like the Seven Fairies? <laughs>、uh, like, you know, Yokai, like Yokai Watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yokai. You're right, yeah. Yeah, let's、uh, do another thing. Yeah, so let's take a tenner. Yeah.
So we'll, we'll be, be back, back in about 10 past the hour with more of this. We're going to run some ads and hold yeah. tight. Woo! Good show. show. Action.
Weird show. Show. And we're back. So, so before we, oh, yeah, <laughs> before we get going, Will sent me the thing that uh, Greg suddenly decided that there was just mosquito. Mosquito. I, 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 I realized another tragic element in Rico's story. Oh, not, not only. Is that guy not actually Ushio? I mean, that guy, Uma. But it's not mutual. Remember, oh, we met right. Ushio going to buy, and he, he wanted to propose to, to a different girl. girl. That's right. Yep. So oh, I wonder man. how that's going to go. Oh, man. Right? Maybe you know? maybe Umabe convinces Rico to go her own way. Oh my god. I don't know. And how's Machiru gonna fit in with this? Fuck right. Right. You seem to be fine. Expectations are high for Shichiokai. Masashi asked, Hey, what is the purpose of the Shichiokai? Addendum, who created the Shichiokai? Mosquito? Greg, come on. Mosquito. Mosquito. Okay, um, I don't know. I think, uh, mm. either A or B, I feel. Yeah. What is the goal of the Seven Day Society? It's like, were you told to ask about that? <laughs> Yeah, no. Morasuna. Uh, I think that it's like rule six never leak uh, organization secrets. That's right. Oh, right, because it yeah. keeps. Yeah. I think, oh, let me just make sure that it is actually Morasu. Uh, it is Morasu, yes. Uh, so, one, sold on shoe, what? I tell me to look at the other person when you're in a negotiation. Two, Michiobi ni wa zettai fukushu. Uh, like, obey Sunday. Like, obedience to Sunday is absolute. Mm -hmm. Three, honmyo wa dasanai, no real names. 
for Shabuna Ukita Monoa, Solo Shabuchan Istagau. Uh, one who has been punished must follow the orders of the Punisher. Mm-hmm. Five, <laughs> Sekuharo wa Kimbatsu. Uh, sexual harassment will be severely punished. For, severely punished. Yep. And now, six, Soshiki no Himitsu wa Morasuna. Don't leak uh, organization secrets. I'm going to guess there are seven rules because it's seven days. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Seven rules of society. Yeah. <laughs> nice. What, rule one, look at the other party during negotiations. Two, absolute obedience on Sundays. Three, do not reveal your real name. Four, those who have been punished obey the person who punished them. Five, sexual harassment is severely punished. Six, don't reveal the organization's secrets. And other than absolute obedience on Sundays, which is a valid way to read that sentence in an but ordinary not context. <laughs> not the correct one. Yeah. Dojin wa uh, shoot, that's a emo. It's a body part. I know that much. Oh boy. Hara. Oh, this is Hara. I've never seen that kind of Hara. Okay, Hara ni hibiku koedita. Like the old man said in a low, like belly rumbling voice. Yeah. <laughs> nice. すみません. So sorry. So sorry. What is the purpose of Shichiokai? Were you asked to ask that? Said the voice. I'm sorry. Greg, come on. Get if you're not going to fucking try. Thing. There's a lot of pigeons. Okay, that's the game he's playing. Uh, Thursday rested his chin atop the stick between his legs. Sticky. あ、純金のスティックが自慢だが重すぎるのとあ、あ、こう、こうね、すぎるのが理由で家のあ、飾りになっている。今作っているのは普通のあ、散歩用のもので、あ、同じものを3本持ち、あ、あ、曜日によって
solid metal is what we oh yeah, yeah he's like yeah he actually does have a solid gold king as i think one of them okay. yeah yeah june june king is i think solid gold actually hmm. now that i think it Yes, it is actually. Okay. So yeah, I thought it was pure metal, but no, it is solid gold. Yeah, pure gold. It boasts a cane made of pure gold, but because it is too heavy and too expensive, it is used as a decoration in the house. The one I'm using now is for my regular walks, and I have seven of the same one, and I use them differently depending on the day of the week. Interesting. Already he's kind of an interesting character, but I'm expecting yeah. some sort of fall from grace. Kimi mo esa yatteru to ii. Like, you can feed them too if you want. Uh, Iwareru mama ni Masashi wa uh, mame wo yatta. Uh, Masashi did as he was told and tossed out some seeds or beans, some I guess. Beans. I guess you feed, like, like, yeah, like, I guess, like, little soybeans or something I, like that. I don't know. I guess. I don't know. If you if you just say mame in Japanese, Cause, yeah, I'm like, curious. Because it's, it's beans, right? Because edamame oh. is soy Yeah, edamame is soybeans, yeah. Yeah, if I type in just mame, it's like, yeah, like any kinds of beans, yeah. They're probably, okay, like little, like... Pellets or something. I'm going to be like, what kind of beans... Do you feed to pigeons? <laughs> no, I'm gonna see if I get any insights from Google Sun. Mm -hmm. On uh, uh, indoor mame. That's right. This is uh, I I know I heard about this a little while ago. They're indoor, uh, mame? indoor mame, which is like they're like uh, it's the it's like the common pea. Yeah, they're like oh. probably like, like dried green peas. Yeah. Are those good for burb? Uh. And did Archie oh. set himself up a business? Yeah, right. I'm gonna see. Is giving. Uh, yeah, new Oh. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, apparently they do eat beans it's just like much like when you're feeding them things like bread or something like just don't overfeed them that's the big risk with birds yeah or they'll explode <laughs> they will it's like watch they're ve they're very offensive like very aggressive and it's like i'm not sure who decided that like the dove was a symbol of peace ah uh, see so dove and pigeon have kind of like the same in Japanese. That's why when I said earlier, I was saying dove. Mm -hmm. And then, like, the picture came, I was like, oh, it's like pigeons. Shit doves. Yeah. It's kind of like how Nizumi is both like, yeah, rat um, and uh, mouse. Yeah, Dario so was, was so was, like, disappointed when I told him that. He was correct. Yokotori suru hato, dashaburu hato, jiko, su, uh, so it's like, you know, pigeons would like dart in, like from the sides, they'd like charge forth, they would stand their ground, fight each other, some would like get injured. It's like, you're right, I never really noticed before. Look, that's pretty aggressive. Who the hell decided that the dove was a symbol of peace? That's right. A pigeon that steals. Intrusive pigeon. A self-assertive pigeon. Bats that attack each other. A disturbing pigeon. One of those bat. things is not the other, Greg. Yeah. Hato. You're reading it as bato. Hato. Yeah. Also, the Japanese word for bat is komori. <laughs> so... Prefecture? <laughs> Prefecture. Komori. 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 As opposed that to Fukuro, which is owl. Huh. Well, who told this? Esa nado wa taeru deki de nai. And it's like, like, you're, you're not obligated to feed them. 
。はい。あ、そう言って、木曜日は、あ、豆をまいた。And like, as he said that, like, Thursday tossed out some more peas. だが、人は餌を与える。But people feed them anyway. なぜかな、金曜日くん。Why, why is, is that, this? do you think? Yeah. Yeah. For why? For why? よくわからないが、あインチクじゃあ、インチクあー、that's f u k u m a That's the first one. And it's like this, this, uh, he couldn't, he didn't quite know what, but, uh, like this story seemed to have some, like, meaning to it. Like, he seemed like he was going somewhere, but he didn't know where. Hmm. Oh, he sort of trailed off. No, no, no. Yoko wa karna ga ganchiki no ara hanashi da. It's like, Masashi's like, the story had some kind of point. But, but he like, wasn't Masashi sure didn't, he, didn't what what it, he wasn't sure what it is yet. Like, he yeah. hasn't gotten to the core of it. So. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's like, the pigeons. That's so, yeah. Uh, no karasu wa minasai. Uh, go, look at the crows over yonder. Mokyobi wa sticky day, uh, showman no ki ni, uh, tomaru karasu wa sashita. Uh, Thursday used his cane to indicate. Uh, crows that had stopped in the tree across oh, from. Oh, he's explaining the purpose of the seven day society by using birds for like regular people、mm. and the crows as them, I think. At least、Something、that's why.、Like, yeah. Yeah. He, he's, he's, you know, trying to do some sort of metaphor here. You shouldn't feed them, I said, throwing beans on Thursday, but people give food. I don't really understand it, but it's a story with implications. Look at the crows over there. Thursday pointed to a crow perching on a tree in front of him with his walking stick. There it is, the sound. I feed the crows as well, but they never fight each other. You can have a show about a crow who's graduating, call it like Kurasu of 89. <laughs> Well, that would be Kurasu, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is Kurasu. Huh. Sonna mono kamo shirenai. Sonna mono kamo. It's like, oh, maybe that was the case. There's also one, two, three, four,、uh, five, six, seven crows in that picture. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Good eye. Daga, Hato wa heiwa no symbol, symbol de ari. Kurasu wa bukimi na. Uh, Zolchol no mama da. It's like, however, like, doves are the symbol of peace, whereas, like, crows are like a, a symbol of, like, ill omen. Like, why is, why is that, that Friday? Masashi wa sono tatoe manashi ni waku waku to shita. Like, this, like, this, uh, like, Ex- exemplary like tale had、uh, like Masashi excited. I mean, yeah, no, if I was a Mas-、yeah. Masashi in this, he's like, oh, this is going somewhere and I'm、yeah. for This guy、it. rules. <laughs> he's gonna suck, but he rules right now. I feed the crows too, but the crows. Parable, that's the word. I'm like, a story、Parable. that makes the example.、Yeah. Parable, that's the word I'm looking for. Fuck.、Right. I was like, I know we have a word for this in English. It's all Bible story. Exemplary story. You know what I meant, people. <laughs> <laughs> the story was exemplary. Oh, it's a parable like with the Jesus. <laughs> he said, parably.、Uh, Maybe so, but the dove is a symbol of peace, and the crow remains an eerie symbol. I wouldn't say eerie, like.、Yeah. Bukini, Bukini is like eerie or unsettling. Yeah, un- I would have gone with unsettling.、Yeah. I wonder why, f r e d e r i c o n She was、Or、thrilled by the parable. Ominous. Oh, ominous.、Uh, they, the they, crow、uh, remains an ill omen.、Uh, a portent of ill omen. A portent. Ooh, there、yeah. you go.、Um, she was thrilled by the parable, said Thursday, who apparently is non binary and go them. Sate to, Ikoka. Now then, shall we head off? 
はい老人は立ち上がった。The old man stood up. ハトとカラスと父を変え。Like the pigeons, the crows, the seven day society. それからどうつながるのだろう like, ?How did those things interrelate?、Uh, he's... How, are the, how, how are those things connected? connected yeah. There we go. There we、yeah. go yeah. Well, let's go. Yes, the old man stood up. Pigeons, crows, shichiokai. How are they connected? Thursday swung around his cane and took a deep breath. Masashi wa Suginaru Rodin no Kotoba o Motta. Masashi waited for the old man to continue. Friday, Yes. Hi. <laughs> Friday, you. Yeah, Yogi Park in October is、uh, nice. She Friday, waited. Kimi, Kung desu. You got it right on the previous fucking page, Greg. She waited for the next words of the old man. Friday, you. Hi. No. Wrong. Incorrect. By the way, I have a、uh, new beer here. I've never had it's a 2.5 times IPA.、Oh. I guess it's not quite a double, not kind of cool, but it's called Hello Dankness, my old friend. Oh,、uh, who's the brewery? <laughs> uh, Barrel Brothers? I don't、right. know if he has it. I am not familiar with Barrel Brothers, but I, I appreciate a good name. I'll, I'll, I'll send you a picture of the can afterwards. Yes, I think oh, yes, please.、Uh, I got Mominoki.、Uh, Mominoki is like a Japanese fir tree. Like F I R. Mominoki. m a t s u k a no Joryoku Komoku. I think that's a, an evergreen tree in the、uh, pine family, p a n a c e a m a i t o s h i June Ichi Gatsugoro, d e p a r t o no. Uh, tento, uh, moriba, nado de, uh, totsen, uh, hatsuiku? Yeah, uh, hatsuiku, uh, ginko no seiken no, uh, miya, uh, ten metsu suru illumination no yo na hana o tsukiru ga, Christmas o tsugiru to, uh, ichi ya ni shite, uh, <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's a, an evergreen、uh, tree in the p a n a c e a family.、Uh, every year around December, like out in front of like department stores, like in places like they'll suddenly like sprout up everywhere, and like you'll have.、Uh... Oh, uh, that's not. Ginko, that's a kingin. A kingin no seigata no miya. So it's like they'll have like gold and silver stars or like sparkly lights set up like flowers.、Uh, but once Christmas is over, like it, like it's basically Christmas is going to be a c h r i s t a y Oh, uh, Kare Hateru Hakanai. Yeah, like, and it doesn't just like die the day after Christmas. Ugh. Fir tree, an evergreen tall tree of the pine family. Around December every year, it grows suddenly in department stores and entertainment areas and bears gold and silver star shaped fruits and flowers that look like blinking lights. But after Christmas, it dies overnight. Yeah, that's yeah. basically it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, uh, Hakanai. Yeah, yeah, Hakanai is like it's fleeting. Yeah, yeah. So, Kare Hatera Hakanai, yeah. It, it, it's a fleeting tree that does die over. Yeah, yeah. Boku s t e k i o m a s u i n i s a s h i t a He pointed his cane directly ahead. So, no tonari ga, uh, e, she, e. Oh, crap. I, uh, Uh, 
Ah, she, yeah, yeah. She no he, uh, is a uh, is a beech tree, mm-hmm. and Sugiga. See if I can get this to go in. Uh, Kashi, uh, it's an evergreen oak. So like next to that is a. Yeah, what did I say the second one was? A beach. Yeah, it's like next one is next is a beach. And then you have an evergreen oak. All right. Arega sakura, arewa ume. There's a cherry tree. There's a plum tree. Dojin wa sorera no kigi wo hitotsu hitotsu kaisetsu shite aruku. Like the old man went along, like identifying trees one after the other. That's a fir tree. Thursday pointed straight at his cane. No, he pointed his cane at the thing. <laughs> Next to that is the linden tree. Next is the oak. Those are cherry blossoms. Those are plum blossoms. Let's see if we can get a better read. Shiitake tree. No. Yeah, it, it is the kanji for shiitake. Shiitake, but, but it's uh, not that reading. Yeah. The chinkapen. The old man suddenly came to a stop. Kiyomi-kun. Hi. これこそが一応の日。あ、樹齢、あ、およそ、あ、500年だ。おう。あ、一応の日。あ、じゃ、銀行。あ、樹齢、it's like yeah, it's over 500 years old. いちょうの木、いちょうかのあ、あ、落葉鉱木。あ、だし。あ、あ、だし植物。イエス、だし植物で、オスメスがある。あ、化石にもある暗い古くから地球に存在する樹木。あ、大気。ちさん。あの、うさん、あ、フェアウォッド。ウォッドアダリーディングオブキタナイズ。オンヨミイズ。オ。そう、オセン。うん。ね、オセン。Yes. あ、あ、大気汚染に強いため、あ、あ、が、が、街路樹に多い。うん。あ、あ、種は、あ、あ、銀なんなんで、あ、銀、銀。あ、とても臭いが、あ、茶碗虫に入っているとちょっと嬉しい。Okay, so a uh, deciduous plant uh, uh, of the uh, ginkgo family. Uh, it is a gymnosperm, mm-hmm. uh, meaning that there are both like male and female. Um, they are a very, like, old tree, uh, having been around for a long time, like, with, uh, examples in the fossil record. Um, they stand up well to atmospheric pollutants, and so, uh, you see a lot of them lining city roads. Yeah. Um... Ah, Ginnan. That's what that is. Uh, yeah, the, the, its seeds are ginkgo nuts, which are extremely odorous, but it makes me a little happy. 
uh, when I get some in my chawamushi. What's that? It's a uh, chawamushi. is like a kind of steamed uh, egg custard. Okay. It's like a savory custard. It's got like chicken and stuff in it. So it's not like a dessert custard. It's like a, I guess closer to like a. Well, it's peach. like when you get steamed eggs at um. Yeah. Korean barbecue kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. It's it's a very Asian egg preparation. Yeah. Ginkgo tree, the delicious, the deciduous, oh boy, it's been a day, hasn't it? A deciduous tall tree of the ginkgo family. It is a gymnosperm and has a male. Yeah, female, but they didn't say that part. Yeah, yeah, apparently. A tree that has existed on Earth since ancient times, so much so that there are even fossils of it. Due to its resistance to pollution, it is often found in roadside trees. One seed is ginkgo, and it smells very bad, but it makes me happy when it's in chonmushi. Because yep. we don't really have a localized term for that, and that's a pass. Yeah, chawanmushi. <clears throat> yeah, it's just chawanmushi. And yeah, ginkgo, if you've ever smelled ginkgo, it's very, uh... It's a very distinctive scent. I'd have to check into that. Yeah. Hot. Smells a bit like somebody outside had a cheeky wank. Oh, the trees that smell like cum. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so, <laughs> poor thing. Kenko, as in the coffee? Like, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> no, they're the cum trees, say, like. Oh, bless. The old man suddenly stopped. Can you obey Yes. This is the ginkgo tree. Tree age about 50, 10 years. Ha. Ah, no. I mean, 50 tens is 500. Yeah, I think he stole 40 cakes. That's, that's as, as many, many as, as four tens. tens and that's terrible. And that's terrible. Can you all become? Hi. These trees smell of cum. Ningen. Kino nawe no shiro koto wa taisetsu wa. It's important for people to know the names of trees. That's what, you know, living alongside nature is about. Huh. Mm. Thursday gave a satisfied nod. Can you open? Hi. Uma. It's important to know the name of the tree. That's what it means to live with nature. Yeah. Uh, Thursday? What is it, Friday? <clears throat> so, how are the doves and the trees and the Seven Day Society? Uh, <laughs> yeah. How is this all, you know... Um, Thursday, what is it? Oh, come on, Greg. It. Dojin wa fui o tsukareta, uh, kao shita. Like, the old man looked a bit, like, taken aback. Uh, I know, ima no, well, I mean, like, just now, tatoe barashi janakatta on desu ka? Like, like, that wasn't, like, some kind of, like, parable. Like, <laughs> like, you were using, like, the birds and the trees to, like, you, as an analogy for, like, the Seven Day Society for something? Yeah, so, so that's Oh, is that what I was doing? <laughs> okay. Oh, am I not right? The old man made a confused face. Um, that was just now. Wasn't it a parable? Compare the pigeons and the tree to Rikai? Something like that, yes. Was that so? What, was it wrong? To Rikai? Ah, who knows. Oh, sorry, give me just a second. Now I'm thinking about it. 
All right, the doves and the seven days society. I'm thinking. Ah, Mokuyobi san, kekko desu. Oh, that, that's okay. Uh, Thursday. Like, muri shinai de kudasai. Like, please don't, like, trouble yourself. He's pretending to be an old man to not answer the question. Yeah. Yeah, so more you can't. No, no, it's all right. Hato wa shiokai. Okay, so the pigeons are the seven days. Mm. Yeah, hontoni mokuyobi san. No, Thursday, honestly. It's okay. <laughs> Hmm, I'm sorry, I've been waiting for you for a moment. Pigeons and Shichiokai. Hmm, I'm thinking about it now. Mr. Thursday, no thanks. Please don't overdo it. The pigeons are on the seventh day of the week. No, really, Mr. Thursday. Nirobi-kun, Shichiokai to karasu. Demo ii kane. Like, alright, like, so Friday, like, you, you, you got the, the Seven Day Society and the Crows, right? Hi, I don't, yeah, right. Wait, no. Chichiokai to karasu. Right, so that. Kikyo sori ni mo imi wa nakatta. It's like, apparently, in the end, there hadn't been any meeting after all. Great. Honto ni mo ii desu kara. No, honestly, it's it's fine. Yosh. Okay. Kinyobi kun, arukou. All right. Let's, let's take a walk, Friday. Friday, Shichiokai and Crows. Hmm. In the end, there was no color for that either. Really, it's enough. No, Greg. <laughs> Where'd you get color from? Oh, Karasu. Right. Oh my god. Fucking hell, Greg. <laughs> it goes back to Pokemon. <laughs> Thursday, like, swung his cane about in a big arc as he walked along. Like, walking is the best thing you can do for your health. It's like, some people will say that running is good too, but some people say it actually shortens your lifespan. It's like nobody says anything like that about walking. It's like, I mean, that's because, like, there's nobody who doesn't walk. <laughs> uh, Thursday? Uh-oh. What is it, Friday? On Thursday, I walked around with a big swing of my cane. The best way to start healthy is to walk. Some people say it's good to run, but others say it shortens your life. Nobody says anything about walking. Is there anyone who doesn't walk? Lada. Um, Mr. Thursday. data. <laughs> <laughs> And it's like, let, let's give up on, oh no, it's like, look, look, let's forget about the, the story and what's, <laughs> like, my data for today. Like, the, who's my target? The, like, yeah, like the, who's the like, mark? Yeah, I need, like, the, the details, like, the intel on my target. The it's like Sunday told me to come here and get that from you. Oh, come on. Uh, Greg? I've given up on parables, but here's today's data. Stay. Oh, crap. Thursday indicated a nearby bench with his cane. Let, let's, let's sit down Friday. Hi. Hmm. Oh, no. Thursday pointed to a nearby bench with his cane. Let's sit down. Friday, you. Hi. Hey, Mal. Hello, Mal. 
He just came back from watching the Mario movie with his nephews. Hey, Mal, our local bar that I go to all the time just got Molson on tap, so we're living the dream. Of we're cheap living Canadian the Canadian beer. dream. <laughs> I mean, when I'm in Canada and I'm at parties, I'll put down Molson's like anyone else, but still. <laughs> all right, Friday, are you ready? I, I mean, I guess. Wakiobi was teki ago no seta. Thursday set his jaw atop the cane. Hato ga suyau no wa suyoi mono to yoai mono ga iru kara. Like the reason that pigeons fight each other is because there are those who are strong and those who are weak. Hato ga itsu mane mo heiwa no shinbaru de ari tsuzukeru no no wa. And it's like, and the, so the fact that pigeons have continued to go on to be a symbol of peace is. Dare kaga mukashi hato heiwa no design ni tsukatta kara da. It's like, like, a long time ago, somebody used a dove in like a design for peace. Oh my god. Huh. <laughs> he's, a, he's a little off his rocker, I think. On the surface. So Friday, you okay? Ha ha ha. And Thursday, I rested my chin on my walking stick. The reason- oh, come on. This is what it sounds like when it does fight. It does fight because there are strong and weak. Ha. Ha. To washiwamo is what I think. So no toki a shoujo, a shouhyo toroku. I think, uh, yeah, I think it's trademark registration. Yeah, shōhyō, uh, yep, shōhyō. Uh, shōhin ni tsubite hōka no shōhin to kubetsu suru tame ni tsukita moji, uh, zutai kigō nado. Kore o tōroku suru to, uh, shōhyō, uh, ken ga hasse shi, uh, hōka no kaisha ga mane deki naku naru. Shunsoku no maku, Nanka mo sono ishu. So, uh, trademark. A, like, like, lettering, uh, like, drawing or, like, symbols that are placed on a product in order to distinguish it from other products. Mm -hmm. Uh, by registering this, you can establish, like, trademark rights on something and other companies cannot copy you. Uh, and it's like, the, the Chunsoft mark is an example of, uh, such, such a thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A trademark is a letter, figure, symbol, etc., attached to a product to distinguish it from other products. If you register this, you will have the trademark right, and other companies will not be able to imitate it. The Chunsoft mark is one of them. Sure. All right. So, some of uh, and it's like, man, if he had trademarked it back then, he'd be a very rich man, I bet. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, Thursday. Hmm? Oh, Oh, yes, Friday, that's right. Are, are, are you moved? <laughs> It's like, Thursday, I don't need to hear any more about doves. Please give me today's data. <laughs> well, I think if I had registered the trademark on that time, he would have been able to make a lot of money. Thursday, hmm? Friday. Taka. Thursday, I finished talking about pigeons, so please give me today's data. Ha ha! Friday. Ha <laughs> ha! Friday. Ha <laughs> ha! Friday. Speaking of times, is oh, it yeah. the time? I think we, yeah, let's, let's put a pin in here and let's go to question no Chikanda. Boop. So, uh, if you have questions about the translation of this game, or questions about translation in general, we'll be happy to try and answer them.
Oh, here we go. Doppel comes in with, Did you work on Sonic Unleashed? I recently learned how wildly different all of the versions of that game are, and was wondering what development slash localization was like. Uh, I worked tangentially on Sonic Unleashed. I'm pretty sure it was the last uh, Sonic game that got released when I worked there. Uh, I forget if it came up before or after Colors. We, we were working on Generations when I was let go. What about uh, So I didn't Black see Knight. Generations finish. Yeah. Um, that was around then. Yeah, I uh, I did I did actually freelance translation work on Generations after I was gone from Sega. Ah. Um, at least I think it was Generations. Um, but uh, yeah, I did I did some pickup translation on Sonic Unleashed, like a lot of like just random like townsfolk dialogue from like the different countries, and like stage hint messages because like they change the designs of like levels and stuff so they need to, oh, we need to put in like a new hint message here to tell people what to do and where to go and like I, I didn't do the main translation but like once things were already in like the alpha beta like stage and mm -hmm. like they were still doing new text at that point it's like well we don't have time to send it out to the agency that did the original translation we just need to find somebody here who speaks Japanese to do it <laughs> and so that would be me uh, a lot of the time. Um, as for what it was like, oh my god, there was a lot going on. Uh, <laughs> Chip, Chip was originally going to be named Whip. They really wanted to name him Whip. Uh, they're like, yeah, because he's like, he's like whipped cream. Like that's, I'm like, no one is going to make that distinction. When you hear the name Whip, like you think of like a dominatrix or maybe Indiana Jones. But like, if you just hear the word Whip in English, that doesn't mean whipped cream to us, right? I mean, like, Sonic could ghost ride the whip. Yeah. He could ghost ride the whip. <laughs> but he shouldn't be behind the wheel of a car, because he's too fast without one. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> it's Kevin's yeah. Sonic tips. Your Sonic I... is bad, and you should feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> I remember there was talk, they were like, we're thinking of possibly doing a sequel to Sonic Unleashed, and they're like, what percentage gameplay-wise of, like, werehog to normal content should there be? And, like, we were all like, zero percent? Like, that stuff sucks and no one likes to play it. And it's like, here's, like, a fun Sonic level that's, like, a side-scrolling like fast paced like cool thing it takes like two to three minutes to beat now spend the next 40 hours playing slow shitty god of war with no combos and no like fun gory death animations that's what the werehog levels were <sighs> so hopefully hopefully if that answers your question Tom yeah, no, like, <laughs> it, internally, everyone was like, what, what is this? It, like, it, it was, it was, I was gonna mention the weird sex mini game, but, Wait, uh, what? about when I mentioned God of War, oh, I was like, right, you can yeah. go and, like, do your little sex mini game. Well, it's Sonic, so people just take the sex mini game offline, yeah. and, uh, they make their own. Yeah, it's, uh... Man, that's the one thing like we're, we're talking about. Like, I I haven't finished the story of Sonic Frontiers yet because I'm just experiencing it through the Game Girls playthrough uh, thereof. But it's just kind of one of those like I appreciate them doing something different and like giving things like a mature story and like getting like one of the actual like comics writers in to do stuff. But I'm just like, why is it these characters in this world that like? people decided they wanted really grown-up stories told about like it just i don't get that and i never have and it's like hey like we'll have like amy rose and sonic having like weirdly deep heart to hearts and it's like right but where is this coming from like this has never been these characters like mo at all like tales is one kind of makes sense he just goes really fucking hard on it 
<laughs> Mal says I made the joke with the Sonic Bioware RPG. If this is a Bioware RPG, where's the phoned in sex scene? Oh nice. my god. I'm almost surprised they didn't put one in. <laughs> uh also like that game it made Ken Pender so mad. I feel we should. Yeah, you play can't it. you can't use echidnas! I invented echidnas! They're my animal! Ugh. I invented so many Knuckles OCs! I gave Knuckles an entire family tree! The infant's gonna be gay! I'm <laughs> Ken Penders! <laughs> Fuck A. I oh. have no idea what Ken Penders sounds like, so that's the voice I'm giving him. Which, if anything, that sort of shows his involvement with Sega. <laughs> oh my god. It's been a while since we've went on a, on a Ken Penders A, a Pender Bender. Ken Penders, it's just Sonichu. Oh my god. The, uh... Yeah, there's there's a lot to unpack with the creator of Sonichu. Things uh it's unfortunate for everyone around. Let's just say that. Fair. <laughs> um Yeah, it, in it involved like elderly abuse and I don't know if you know about this. It's not a fun conversation to have, so let's not. All right. <laughs> All right, let's let's. Avoid I'll, I'll, I'll I'll take it offline. I'll tell you what happened. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. Not <laughs> a fan of that. that. Yeah, <laughs> like the what is like the Fallout like four. Like nobody liked that. <laughs> or like yeah. everybody but just liked that. Everyone yeah. disliked that. Yeah. Everyone disliked that. It's like yeah. Oh no. Like this is like a case of like okay like a lot of people did some really monstrously mean things to this person. Oh. However, this person is still ultimately control over all of their own actions, and they've done some pretty horrible shit, too. <sighs> and that doesn't, like, you can be the victim of bullying, and you can be a shitty person at the same time. It is, uh, it's... Like I said, it's not a... <laughs> yeah, so let's go back to 06. Speaking uh, of complete shit shows that nobody likes, Sonic 06. Well, I mean, there's that one guy who's fixing it, and holy shit, it's like legitimately playable for the most part. It's really interesting. <laughs> Sonic 06. Great Sonic game or the greatest Sonic game? <laughs> no, neither. Like, oh, Pro man. Project 06 is, like, this amazing work of love that they were just basically... Th this guy who had never played the original game was like, I think I can fix this, and has been doing so in, I think, Unreal Engine. Okay. But they've tried to use as much of the original assets as possible, but they've been, like, making the game work, which I, like... I, I watched, say, like, struggle through, like, the first Sonic level, and then I played, like, the Project 06 version, and there, I mean, the Son the Project 06 version is just gonna look better, because, you know, it's all nice new HD textures and stuff, but, like, as a game, it plays like a game, and not Sonic Team once again being overworked and releasing something way too early that doesn't work. Like, we have to release this, it's like... But you tried to make a game that you needed, like, four times as many people to make, and never had that. And so it's garbage. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, they did that without the source code. I mean, you can... Given where game development is, it's very easy to find tools to, like, crack open things these days. Possibly saying in my playthrough, flames and captured in, in, in Forest Field, and Destiny's an edgy sound. I was like, this is cartoon hedgehog, folks. <laughs> and he kisses a human woman. Does on the lips. On the lips. Be all And then uh, that's what allows David Lopan to become mortal. <laughs> and uh, Sonic catches the knife really fast and throws it back into his head. Yeah. You won't put it on this world. You won't put on this world to get it, Mister the Hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, does this make Wang tails? Sure. <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Why not? 
<laughs> that joke writes itself. Uh, <laughs> bless. And then uh, Amy Rose is Gracie Law. Uh huh. Yeah, it well, works. Knuckles is the fat one. Um, there's that other guy, right? Who's like, he's in for a wedding or something. That would be Knuckles. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, um, he's the one who was actually supposed yeah. to get married. I don't know who Egg Fu Young would be. That would be... Oh, God. Egg Shen can Egg be... Egg Shen, that's right. God, they'd probably make him silver and ruin the whole thing. It's no <laughs> use! Actually, just make Egg Shen Blaze. Fuck it. Oh, yeah, Shares everyone loves Blaze, sense. right? Yeah, Blaze is great. <laughs> I love the Grumps. Oh, Tails, my friend. I wish you were Blaze. <laughs> and Mr. Y yes, Mal is right. And Mr. Yuji Naka, Yuji Naka leaving mid-development to make his own company of Kiwi and tapping games and insider trading. Uh... How Good hard did you tap? Yeah, how hard did you fight for let's tap that? <laughs> how hard did I fight for what? Like it would have been great if you fought for it to be called let's tap that. For um let's tap. Is that what they called it? The the Wii game where you like tapped on the board? Yeah, let's tap. Yeah. yeah. It would have been that great was, to fight for like there. tap that as a name. Tap that. Yeah, no, I'm like, Yuji Naka, he had this idea for this other game that, I mean, he's not ever going to work in the industry again, so whatever. Yeah. Um, like, it was this, like, little dragon sorcerer game that was going to use the Wiimote to, like, let you cast spells. Oh, that sounds cool. And, right, but then you like, then we realized, like, oh, wait, like, the Wiimote, especially in the early days before you had the Wii Motion Plus, like, just didn't fucking work. And so, like, it wasn't, like, there was no way to pull it off, right? I and mean, like, they oh, kind of did like, with Okami, but they did yeah, like really simple. But they shapes. didn't. But they didn't make it for the Wii. They made that for PS2. Right? And then they, yeah, they ported it. So they ported it to yeah. the thing, yeah. Well, but yeah, it would have been cool. But it turns out like Hijinaka doesn't actually know how to make a game, as he has proven repeatedly. You hit big in the early '90s, and then we gave you 30 more years. To impress us again, which was 30 years too many. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dragon. I want Dragon Wizard too. So yeah, who I... doesn't want Dragon Wizard? Well, speaking of magic, I think the magic has run out. Oh, Billy Hatcher. I... Was, was that even Yuji Naka? I know that was Sega. Uh, it was at least Sega. Um, yeah. Whom yeah. Whomst. Who's done the Billy Hatcher? Uh, Billy Hatcher and the... Oh, it was produced by Yuji Naka. But who uh, actually made it? Yeah. <laughs> um, Shun Nakamura. Shun Nakamura. Yeah. Oh, the yeah. Sonic R guy! <laughs> cool. Uh... <laughs> oh, the director of Sonic 06. Uh, uh, Shun Nakamura. Oh, uh, he... Oh, he was dev support on Sonic Heroes. No! Puyo Puyo Tetris. Oh, he was an assistant producer on Sonic Frontiers. With oh, okay. Oh, F Flirt McPlurpenstein. Flirt McFlurton. Yeah. <laughs> uh, where did Yu Suzuki go, anyway? Out of Sega. He went yeah, and did he, his own thing. He went and did <clears throat> Shenmue 2.1 of Fragmentary Passage. <laughs> yeah uh, poor guy it was a cool idea but Yakuza did it better <laughs> unfortunately Where the, what can you tell me about the four voodoo but yeah I think uh, let's kill the magic for it yeah um, thank you all for joining we're going to call this question no jikan data uh, we should be back next weekend I think Yes. Yeah. Yes. So uh, I think the week after that we're gone. Yeah. Um, thank you all for joining. I'll be back Friday evenings and Saturday and Sunday mornings and afternoons. And I hope you have a lovely rest of your Sunday. Listen. 
<laughs> What's Mal saying? Listen, Mr. Suzuki, you can't make 80s arcades games anymore in the 2020s. Uh, debatable. I mean, indie games. Well, but... he can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. Fuck. Hey, uh... Oh, red thing on that note. Okay. <laughs> well, spicy takes aside. Yeah. We will see you next time. I think half the reason people listen to this podcast is for me to diss. We're not a podcast. We're a stream. But uh, you know what I mean. Well, no, no. We're not a stream. I agree with Aaron Hansen's take on this. We're a show. We are a show. Yeah. But we'll see you next show. Oh, man. Go nuts. <laughs>